Hey, everybody. Phantom Eve, Mohammed. Let's get back to here. All right. So I actually messed with some settings because I realized I messed up yesterday with the uh, encoders. So hopefully today's stream's quality is a lot better. How's y'all day been going so far? Also, let me know if like the sound quality or anything, because I messed with that as well too, if uh, I'm too loud or too low. Hey, just some guy that's like shooters. Ryan, hello. It's fine? All right, Mohammed. All right. Let's see, where were we last left off with? We defeated the Bed of Chaos. So that leaves us with probably going to Seath next or Nido. Audio and video seem good? Good. Glad, Phantom Eve. I know yesterday's one was not as good as I wanted to. I didn't have the encoder set right, unfortunately. But, lesson learned. Actually, fun, uh, funny thing. Um, so because I messed up the encoders, it, because my recording's, uh, bitrate was too high, it made it super laggy. So <laughs> I'm gonna have to do this run all over again, like on my own personal time for footage. So that's gonna be fun. And hopefully it works this time or I'm gonna have to beat the entire run. That's gonna even be more fun. But let's go for a Seath. I think that'll be fun. Yeah, it shit happens. I'm just like, alright, well, I fucked up. Gotta learn for it. Learn from it and then just move on. Can't spend time too much time moping on it. Hey Luke! All right, let's make our way to Seath. Let's see, do I need... Oh, I still have the ring on. I don't need that. I don't think there's any other... You know what? I will take that. Do I have any fire? I don't. Oh, well. I'll live with it. Let's go to see. Okay, goal today. Not to roll once. That's the goal. Go between someone's crotch. So also, I did some testing last night because I was very curious. Like, you know how I did like with oh like Ornstein and Smo, I ended up rolling those few times. Especially with Ornstein when I was locked on. Come to find out, if you even try to just run while you're locked on sometimes, it'll just automatically roll you. So I was screwed when I locked on. Go figure. Maybe it wasn't too smart to have the, uh, the slumbering ring on. Because I'm pretty sure that's why he didn't come soon enough. Normally he comes out and I can, like, curve around him. Oh, that's fun, Warp. That's fun. That's right, because it doesn't place as your last bonfire. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, the boars. The boars are not fun, man. Boars are not fun. Actually, let me take this ring off. I'm pretty sure that's why he didn't come chasing after me. Once again, I get to tease the sentinel's crotch. Don't hit me. Thank you. Yeah, so one, yeah, so one time I needed to, I was like, oh, it would be great. And like, oh, nope. It screwed me over with the distance. Because I didn't think about it. It's like, oh, yeah, he's going to charge later now. Take my souls back. Oh, shit. 
Oh, maybe he went out the ring tonight. Normally, he comes a bit sooner. But also, thinking about it now, I don't have the Ring of Sacrifice, so all those, like, 20,000 souls are going to go down the drain. Huh. And the only one... Like, I only know the one that's up there, so I don't know how I even get... Oh, well. I guess fuck it. Why not? Is what it is. If I have to lose them, I have to lose them. So I'm not backtracking to uh, Seat's little hideout to go get it. Yeah, actually, I might kill the boars. I'm actually kind of curious if I can kill them. I'm at, a, I'm at such a habit of running away from them. I'm kind of actually curious now if I can uh, knock them out. Move, good sir. Keep going, keep going. So everyone had a good day at work? Or school? I'm kind of curious. Let's find out. Come on. So I know for sure I could... Oh, what are you doing, Boar? Boar. What are you doing? Wow, 440. He just let me kill him. All right, I'll take it. I won't complain. Atanas, how are you? Good, man. Good. How about yourself? Yeah, that's good to hear. Hey, let him cook. What's up, man? Oh, just woke up? Just woke up? Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's true. Different time zones. That's right. Alright, board number two is going to be a bit trickier. I know I should be able to get him stuck up here. So he can't make it right here. One. And a two. Two bonks to kill a boar. So if you're ever out in the wild and you come across a boar, just remember two bonks with a stick and they go down. Oh yeah, Luke. No, they're rough, man. They're rough. You like the first time around. I was not a fan. Uh, what is my potential level cap? It's ninety-five. I have some souls I can pop. Oh yeah, you can actually bait them uh, to like two different spots so they can't get to you, and you can just beat them. You, now you can't have to be careful though if you hit them because if they're going into the next animation they can still smack you. Uh, how many? Do I have more? I do not. Oh, it's a, a single point. That's fine. It's still better than losing the whole twenty. Because I know there's another place to get the. Um, Ring of Sacrifice, but I don't recall exactly where you could pick up the ground except that bridge that you have to jump to. Ugh, alright. I'm trying to debate how I want to go about this. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Yep, he always gets me. Unless I'm rolling, then he doesn't get me. Oh, okay. And you're gonna do some dodging. And you always want to go up left here. If you go right, because you have the archer. The right side actually has a guy with a sword and shield, and he will block you. And you won't be able to make it up. You can't see him because he walked down and came back up, but he's usually there. I've made that mistake, and I'm never going to make it again. Ugh. So I'm going to have to take care of Crystal Dude. You can run past them, but I usually just try to 
take him out. He's too much of a pain to try to circle because the crystal lizard can get in your way. And the crystal lizard's gonna just screw you. Come on, big boy. Come on. Big old thick boy. Be a heavy ass roll. Gamma. For him, you don't really need to parry him. He usually will always kind of roll. And you can just get behind him and one shot him usually. Oh, it's in Lost Isolith, the ring? Oh, damn. I wish I would have known back uh, while I was there. Oh, well. It's fine. From like, I don't know, from what we've been noticing though, like it doesn't really seem like I'm going to need all the levels to beat everything. Now, granted, when we get to the DLC bosses, that might change. But I think for the rest of, um, you know, the base game will be fine. Also, I think I figured a way out not to get cursed by Seath. If you don't get killed by him... Like, while he's doing it, like, because you get force killed no matter what. Like, if you last too long, I think if you let him force kill you, you don't get cursed. Now, I could be wrong, but last time, that's how I was able to get away with not getting cursed. Like, right here, he's going to insta-kill me. Yeah, okay, I think I'm right. Yeah, you don't get cursed this way. Hey, Niles, good evening, man. So, fun fact, that's how you don't get cursed on Seath. It took me two whole runs to figure it out, but I did it. <laughs> two whole runs. <laughs> the suffering to do it. I need a bonfire. Oh, fuck you, door. This? Oh, what is happening? Okay, thank you. <laughs> Escape death, hello. How's it going? Oh, then I grab the key. Alex, hey man. I don't know why I felt like I had to do that. Doing good, Niles, doing good. Well, okay, so you weren't here uh, at the beginning. Or some of y'all weren't here, but uh I ended up oh, this could be fun. I ended up oh uh, I'm actually gonna reset so I can say it out loud. So I ended up uh, messing up yesterday with my encoders. So due to my mess up with the encoders, my recording is super laggy, so none of the footage is usable. So I will have to redo this entire run on my own free time. Or hopefully, not all of it, if I did things right today, the recording shouldn't be laggy um, afterwards. But if it is, I'll have to redo the entire run. But it is what it is. I don't. I never streamed before, so I had a big hiccup there. Besides that, it's been going great. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. But the thing is, I actually like the, this run's been kind of fun. Besides, besides Ornstein and Smo, so it's like it's not too too big of a deal. I'm just like, I know when I get there, I was like, at least like I have the experience now. So like, okay, I probably could do it faster. Will I stream the repeat, Luke? No, I like, I'm going to play it safe because of the, rec because I don't know how the, rec like even today, I don't know this footage is going to be usable. I did my best to make sure, but there's like no guarantee I did it right. Because I would have to like, I would have to do a lot of testing and I just didn't have a free time to do that like insane amount. But, no, I'll be doing my own free time to make sure the quality of the content. So, like, when I make the video, it's clean and not, you know, laggy and unwatchable. Yeah, having... <laughs> I'll read it in a second, because the, the tentacle mommies don't want me to go. Tentacle mommies, let me be, please. All right, I'm gonna gamble it and go for the ring. I mean, a key. Got it. Actually, uh, what, 600 S? I don't need it. Y'all can teleport me. All right, let me read it. Uh, I will do that. I watched the video you the skull answered yesterday after the stream. Brilliant video, entertaining me from second one. Oh, I'm really glad, Niles. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, I, it was one hell of a run, the Skull Lantern. Yeah. 
And uh, I had fun trying to like learn some new uh, editing techniques for it. So I'm glad you enjoyed it. Having to do O and S again will still be a little sanity draining, but you've got this. Yeah, thank you, Phantom Eve. Yeah, oh yeah, no, it will it will be taxing, but I'm just glad now. Like I feel like I have the pattern memorized, so I don't think it should take me a hundred tries. Maybe like fifty, <laughs> if I'm lucky. But yeah, I don't think it'd be too bad. Like I feel like I can get it. With knowing everything now, it's kind of like one of those things, like, I've done it, it's like, okay, I could do it again. And I probably could do it a little bit better this time, too. Like, since I've learned a lot. But, it will be done, so we can have that nice footage for the video. And it'll be a fun story to mention in the video as well. The fact that I had to do the challenge run essentially twice. Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't think it's actually worth to get the Firekeeper Soul here. I think the plus four Estus does enough. And if I want a plus five, I could just go for Quaylag's sister. Yeah, you dance, boy. You dance. So I think I'm not going to go get the plus five with, uh... In the cell. I think I'm just going to leave it. I don't think I'll need it. I think it's down. Is it down or up? That is up. Okay. Good, sir. Your hitbox is just big enough. And it's real. Yeah, okay. He's going to shoot, and I should be able to make it down. This is going to be the fun part because I'm pretty sure he's going to do straight. Yep. Oh. You know, you didn't have to... You didn't... Oh. Okay. I had a feeling... Oh, I've actually never had the Chandler get up there with me before. My goal is to fall asleep at 11.55 p.m., so in about 10 minutes. Not like I said... Nope, that's a good call, Niles. That's a very good call, man. It's the rest... Of, getting eight hours of sleep is very important. As someone uh, who's... Spent a good portion of his life getting like four hours of sleep. I highly recommend getting more than that. Your brain will uh, thank you a lot. Oh yeah, the stairs? Yeah. It took me a minute, like even after I beat the game like two or three times to get the hang of like knowing the pattern of like, oh, I gotta do that, that stairs. I gotta go here and then Obviously, after you do it five or six times, you, you, you got it pretty memorized. Except, that's that way. So, can I make it back to the other side? I've never died, so this is very interesting for me. So, I should... Did this rotate back, or is it the same? I think it rotated back. No, I guess I have to go through it again. Oh, nope. Sure, just 10 minutes. <laughs> that was a nice dodge by the arrow. Oh, I didn't even mean to do that. Okay, the stairs just reset. Okay, that's fine. That is what it is. Okay, we didn't have to do repeat... Don't you dare, Chan. Don't make it. Don't make it. Don't make it. Don't make it. Ow. Yeah, this only sucks if you don't kill the Chandlers. You kind of just have to deal with the abuse. Aha. Got oh. Did my control Maybe it was my controller that made it free. So, the game did... Oh, beautiful. So I think my controller disconnected for a second and it made the game lag, which I don't know why it would. Oh, lovely. I could do it again. Yeah, I don't know what happened. I don't know why my controller uh, or why the game froze like that.
Just stuck a leg, just waiting. He just waits. That's what he just does. He just waits. He just waits for that one opportunity to finally, my time to shine, to shoot someone in the head and make them do it all over again. Why? Oh, I wasn't expecting you to follow me because I was just going to kill him so I didn't have to deal with him anymore. Unfortunately, escape death, I guess it's going to be fourth time since I had the wild idea to smack him. This part of me is like, oh, let me kill him so I don't have to deal with it anymore. It's like the downside of not being able to roll. Like, rolling gets you, like, away from things so fast, and then, like, you can keep yourself safe in this little spot because you can roll, and then your iframes protect you. But when you can't roll, you're just like, oh, well. Yeah, well, yeah, he was just straight up doing the, uh, L dance. Well, I don't even remember what the dance was. Some type of dance on me. At least back in the day with Halo, it was just squatting on someone's face. Teabagging. That's what it was back in the Why? Why what's with this with this actor? I gotta run because the dude's following. I call bullshit on the arrow hitting me. Okay. Alright. I'm just running from now on. I'm not wasting my time. Damn the controller, why? Fifth time on the dime. There we go. Really, after this, getting to seats not bad. It's really just this area. It's a bit of pain in the ass. Since they also had a field day here doing control CV. Manipulate the arrow. Yep, no, no, I'm not dealing with you. Probably should be smart and go get the... I could go get the bonfire so I didn't have to go all the way back, but... You know. I'd rather just get the secret door and be over with it. Not for you. Oh, yeah, the first time the crystal cave. Yeah, that's true. Okay, controller, can we not slightly disconnect? I need to buy a new wire. Come on. Yep, I knew it. I gotta move fast and not let my controller disconnect on me. I'm gonna heal up just in case the archer gets lucky. Because he can't hit you, as you can tell. And make it through, come out the door, go to the left. And get the bonfire. Ever played with mouse and keyboard? Uh, not what Souls games, no. Uh, like, I usually, if I'm gonna play with mouse and keyboard, it's gonna be a shooter. That's usually in most cases. Uh, for a while, when I played Monster Hunter World, I did use a keyboard and mouse, but... I usually, when it comes to action games and, like, fighting games, anything like that, I like to be with a controller. And I don't think I need anything else, so we're just gonna straight for the lever and go for Seath. I only have three Estes? Did I not sit at the bonfire? That wasn't smart of me. Also, I probably should... Uh, I should probably play it safe. Yeah, I need to play it safe. What the hell? That was weird. Use the humanity, we get the ash cheeks out, and I'm gonna kindle.
most people play Souls games with controller. Is it easier? I would say it's more of a preference, right? Like, if it's, uh... Like, I grew up on PlayStation 2. Like, so, like, my I'm just used to, like, a PlayStation controller. So my muscle memory, like, from pressing the buttons and everything is just easier, right? Whereas, like, I haven't... I didn't do much keyboard gaming when I was, like, younger. So I naturally pick up on things faster. But, like, shooters, right? It's... You definitely can aim faster with a mouse and keyboard. So I just chose to go that route with it. But to say is it generally easier? I don't know. I think that comes down to which one you're more comfortable with, really. Now the stream is watchable? Yep. Yep. I made sure to fix the encoder. Yep. Oh, no, no, yeah, uh, 100% true, fan. I mean, the game was designed for, um, what, PlayStation and Xbox? So it was always with controller in mind first, so the devs always had that mindset. So it is possible that the keyboard controller stuff is not, uh, keyboard and mouse is not as, as well thought out, but I know there's plenty of people who've done it. Actually, I think for some speed running stuff, they use the mouse and keyboard to uh, help because it does better positioning for some stuff. If I remember correctly from watching uh, one of Gino's videos where he was going over with someone about doing a level one like speed run. Or, or maybe it was not a level one. It was a no hit speed, uh, speed run. Or maybe it was just no hit at all. Maybe it's not a speed run. I don't recall. I just know it was a video recently that he uh, he was going over the explanation of how to do it. Okay, now this is not going to be fun because I normally roll past him. So I don't know how this is going to go. A uh, space to roll has got to be a sin. I, isn't that like the most case for most games where it's... Space the roll with space bar. Okay, that went out way better than I expected. Also, have you ever struggled with the crystal caves? If you can actually watch the little like sparkle things and it'll tell you where the invisible ledges are. Uh, this is like the worst part because I'm probably going to have to deal with the damn clams. And the damn clams always make it in. I haven't figured out if there's a way to, like, bait them not to make it in. Which I'm going to see if this works. Oh, I can't see. Oh, that's interesting. No, he's going to make it. They're too close. They're way too close. They're making it. Beautiful, beautiful man right there. Pinning me a specimen. Oh, ass shot. Go let the ass shot play out, and we're good. I'm gonna let him get a little close. Break it. Clam, no! I thought I got lucky! Run from the clam! No! Kill the clam! <laughs> Rumsoff, you bastards! Why did you allow a clam? Oh, no, 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 Don't die. Oh, son of a. I'm not happy. I'm not happy. Fuck it. I am not. No, I'm screw it. I'm going in with the curse. I'm not dealing with it. Nope. One shot on me, Seath. I don't care. We're going for it. I did 900 damage. Fuck it. Fucking hate the clams. They're harder than they they make seat. Ugh. I don't know why they allowed that. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, for duo fight without being the duo fight. Oh well, fuck it. It's not like I lost that much health. I'm just in one shot range. Well, he kind of did one shot me. Oh well, I love with it. Just keep going, just keep going. Keep 
taking it down. So we did not. Let's see, I did 900 damage, two hits. It should play out the same when running to them. And then. Let's see. Really, I think it might only take like four hits. The crazy thing is, this is not a maxed out club, by the way. This is only plus 13. It can still be higher. <laughs> Oh, 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 I hate that ledge. You can slide off sometimes. Oh, he fell off? Oh, hell yeah. If I do die, I won't have to deal with him again. No, Clam and Seath are more iconic than ONS. Yeah, 100%. Oh, beautiful. Now y'all can't go through the fog wall. Y'all some turds. Can't see you bastards. I see. And my dead body. Actually, it's gonna be very... Oh, why? Controller, controller, no. Oh, see, you're spazzing. I don't know what's been up with my controller today. It wasn't like that yesterday. I might have to switch to the Xbox controller. Oh, controller now. Oh, don't do your slam. Please, no. Don't, don't spaz. You're fine. Man, why is it lagging? Come on. Let me just hit you one more time. There we go. Done and done, lads. Done and done. So, fun fact, I didn't mention it while I was doing it. You can actually make Seath keep spinning in a circle. If you kind of stay near his, like, little tentacle, he'll kind of keep wanting to go. You just If he does his, like, horizontal beam, like, beam you want to, like, get around his tail and you'll be fine. Tyrone, yeah, big bonks. Yeah, I looked away for a few seconds and he's dead. Yep, yep, it didn't take much hits. Uh, let's see, what does that put my cap at? 100? What? Well, it doesn't matter, but I'll mark it down. So let's take that 60. Yeah, alright, let me mess with my controller. Actually, I'm gonna switch to the Xbox controller real quick. Just because I'm tired of it disconnecting. Unfortunately, my wire for my uh, PlayStation 4 is really, really old, and it just does not fit in the hole anymore very well. It's very loose. There we go. Let's level up. Hopefully this will be a lot smoother now since the wire is like this is a the Xbox controller I have is a permanent like is a wired controller so we shouldn't have any issues. Club OP. Yeah, the club is very weirdly OP. Literally it like so I think like a super easy run for anyone like club 
like you put points into strength and vitality and that's really all you need you probably can then put some points into endurance and you're golden like i think you would just destroy like everything you got survivability you got insane damage you're just good to go and i guess now i gotta go back to does any uh oh no, okay, no, it's faster to go there. I'm gonna to go to the un, the FEMA merchant to go uncurse myself. Strength is your go-to ability, uh, Eve. Yeah, no, it's it's powerful with the A scaling. I don't know. Oh, why did I heal? I was like thinking I was somewhere. But I don't actually. I don't even know of that many other um. Classes, like the starting classes, weapons are even have that high of scaling. I could be wrong, but it's just pretty insane how much the damage output. There we go, fly off. Straight up, yeah, it's just came in with rolls allowed, yeah. Dude, if I could, if rolls were allowed in this, oh, caveman run would be like super OP. Caveman is just OP. The power of the bonk. Now, just imagine if I was using the better... The club. This is just the starting club. Don't tell me I'm wrong. Okay, thank God. And... Uncurse myself. And I'm gonna go back. Oh wait, did I? I didn't. Yeah, I had a feeling. Oh well. Let me see. Next thing, we just beat C. If that leaves Nido, which actually I think that just leaves Nido, right? Because then that's the DLC. If I'm forgetting, I don't think I'm forgetting anybody. So Nido. Oh, uh, now now my curiosity. Ooh. Okay, I. I'm gonna go... Should I go do that? I'm gonna go to... Uh, Dark Root Gardens. I'm gonna go pick up the uh, Wolf Ring for Poise. So that when I... I don't... I'm not in the mood to grind to make a Divine Weapon. I think I could DPS it fast enough if I can hit. So I'm willing to risk it for the Biscuit. So I'm, I'm gonna go get the Poise and see if that helps out. Have you read Berserk? Because I think when you play Souls game, uh, gems and no games, and knowing the inspiration makes it more fun. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, I love Berserk. I read Berserk back. Oh, I think I was like 18 or 17 when I started reading Berserk. Uh, yeah, it's super cool knowing that like, uh, like Artorius is lip based off the uh the the Berserk armor. It's super cool to see how much they were inspired by it. Hey, Greg. We just finished off Seath, and now we're making our way for preparations for Nido. Just keep running, just keep running. Oh, I wish you were easier to get to. It should be too bad to get to it. None of the enemies are going to be that much of a pain. So I decided, Greg, that I'm going to risk it for the biscuit. And I'm just going to go for the wolf ring and poise. Because I'm like, I'm doing so much damage that I'm like, you know what? I probably could do it without grinding. So I think I'm going to do it without the uh, holy club. Ah, where am I going? I feel like I'm going like we're in the moonlight. I need to go take a right to hit the tree. The really moving tree. Someone who's uh who read Berserk, I'm going to be honest, Artorius armor doesn't look like the Berserk armor too much. Yeah, it doesn't look like too much, but you could tell they were inspired by it. Like it's not like a one-to-one, -one, right? But even, like, kind of the way Artorius acts when he's the Abyss, or he's, like, in that altered state is kind of like how uh, Guts acts when he puts on the armor. Like, his body contorts in ways that it really normally wouldn't. 
I was saying too, I probably they probably didn't want to like blatantly copy it T for T. And that's just gonna leave that big boy up there. Is it one big boy or two big boys? I wanna say it's one, but it could be two. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Oh, uh, why'd I miss? There we go. Alright, I have the ring. And I don't have anything else on, so I'm gonna put the ring on. And I can bone out. Oh, they hundred. Yeah, oh yeah. The the sword and they kind of always had it like with some of the, the. I think one of the other swords in Dark Souls looks very similar to it as well. It's just not like straight out like one to one. Whereas Elder Ring is a hundred percent one to one. They saw all the people modding in. Guts his sword and stuff, and like, well, screw it, we'll do it ourselves. I gotta take a sip of coffee real quick. Ugh. All right. Difficulty gets same, pretty much, yeah. Really, Nito's like pain in the buttness is from his, uh, it's from his skeletons, right? Because if you kill his skeletons, he's not a big deal. If he has... Why, why am I attempting to walk through the catacombs? Uh, he's not a big deal, but once... If he has his skeletons, he's he, he's annoying. Because his skeletons will just be annoying the entire time. Uh, catacombs. Let me get a sip. Man, if I could, I would let you, man. Could, I would let you. Yeah, oh, that's 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 very true, Greg. It does feel like a massive drop-off and, like, some difficulty. But that's, like, the funny thing with some of the challenge runs, right? Like, it almost... They become actually super hard because they weren't insanely well-balanced. Like, for example, the Skull Lantern, right? I don't do much damage, so when I was fighting them... Like the four kings, it was miserable. Like having to hit them all that many times to uh, do that stuff. Whereas, like, uh, let's say Artorius. Actually, Artorius was easy. It was probably relatively more easier for me than, or less stressful for me than uh, the four kings. Because the four kings, it would I would literally get the four kings down to like maybe a quarter of health, and they would kill me, and I'll be like pissed. <laughs> Whereas the Taurus is, you could you can usually repeat his pattern, and I didn't even have to. Uh, I need to follow the lights real quick. There it is. Okay. I'm gonna focus for a second so I don't fuck up. And there you go. Can, can you ban the bot? Oh, it's a bot. Yeah, I can do that real quick. Let me access it. Studio. Oh, wait, no. That didn't ban the user. Pin report remove. Hide user on this channel. Okay, I think I did it. Let me know if it... If I, I think I pulled it off. I never had to do it before. I'm making it big. I got my first streamer boss. I didn't even realize that was... Okay, so I don't really know much about streaming. I know more about YouTube. I didn't even know that, like, the botting things I like... A th like, streaming bots was a thing. I guess it makes sense.
Where is Scully? We're going for Scully. We're going to get him. He, I have to get pushed off a ledge to get Scully. Batches, you, you can do. You, you, you know what to do. Just push me off, buddy. Just do your thing. I like how he made you look there, and then he's just like, ha ha. So my first time playing Elden Ring, I accidentally like. So if you ever come across uh, patches in Elden Ring. You, like, fight him, and then he, like, gives up. He's like, I'll be your friend. But I didn't realize he was giving up, and I ended up just murdering him outright. <laughs> so, I didn't get to have my experiences with patches in Elden Ring. And Scully's here, lads. Alright, this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna have to deal with the two... Boys. Come on. Oh, no. I didn't think you were going to go first. Nope. Oh, uh, and there's a roll. Well, nope. You know what that means? Like, I knew. I shouldn't have locked on. Nope. Well, fuck it. I don't need it. So, <clears throat> fun fact that I mentioned it earlier just for you, some of you that are here now. So, yesterday when we were talking during the ONS fight about locking on, and I was like, man, I feel like I'm rolling because of the lock on. I tested it after the stream, and it's 100% true. If you try to run in a certain, like, backwards or something, or just move by pressing the circle or the B button, it will automatically roll you. So, the lock on system yesterday fucked me over. This is what it is. So, for uh, any of those that don't know, for the rules, if I roll, I have to use the dark sign to lose all my humanity. And, or, or not human and souls. But is what it is. I don't really need the souls anyways, so. Famous last words. Don't touch me, big boy. Don't touch me. I want to say it's... Oh, wait, no, it's this way. Uh, The knight should be right there. Go this way. Down. Go around. It should be to the right. Yep. Once you make it here, the Black Knight will not follow you anymore. Scully is back in the adventure. Alright, now I gotta make it back to- This is gonna be the fun part, not getting hit towards Nito. Worst DS1 run back? Oh. Oh, that, oh, that's a hard one. I would probably say this going to Nito is my personal, like, I don't like it at all. Like, I know a, a good friend of mine doesn't like, uh, the, like, going running back to the Four Kings. But I've done the Four Kings enough that I'm like, I kind of got a pattern down. I, I fuck this up all the time coming back to Nito. Like, I just cannot get a good pattern down. Mostly due to all the pinwheels and the little baby skeletons, you know. Fucking everything up. So sometimes the pinwheels, you'll get lucky and the pinwheels don't hit you. And then sometimes they'll just spam you. And you're just like, just like that. And you're, you're like, I'll have to get lucky here if I don't die. Oh, that's not going to be good. Come on, make it to the portal. Or fog door, whatever. Oh, there we go. Alright, there's a good chance... That I will die, because I could just get hit twice and get bled, but we'll see how this plays out. If I die too many times, I'll do Divine. Like, I won't- I'm not gonna go that hard about it. But part of me is curious if I could pull it off without being, you know. Oh dear god, how am I gonna dodge his poke attack? Oh no. I just thought about it. You have to roll. I don't think you can outrun it. Oh no. Nito, don't do it. Hear me out. Just don't do it. Oh, so close. Nope, 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 nope. And this is why I don't like the skeletons. Alright, Jesus, yeah. I'll give it like one more go and then I'll go grind for the. Uh, <coughs> I'll go grind to uh, make the holy weapon because it's probably just not worth it. Trying to throw my head at it.
Yeah, it just depends. Like, I know if I can get to them in time, or at least bait Nito to kill them off. But, my, like, I'm more scared at that moment of him. One, I'm going to get toxic if he hits me, and then I'm really screwed. But I just know when he does his little thing where he's like, ha, 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 and then he, like, pokes you, and you're like, oh, no. Oh, wait, where am I going? I'm not paying attention. Oh, wait, I went the wrong... Oh, that's a roll. I need to actually think about what I'm doing. I don't know that this section well. Okay, someone just killed me at this point. I don't have any souls to even use the dark sun. I actually got to focus through this spot because I... I don't know it that well if I'm not, like, actually thinking about it. The first spot's easier to get through. This this second section is a lot worse because you can accidentally get nipped by the uh, the big boy skellies. Or the giant skeletons, I should say. Where did they bite, though? Make it through. And this is why I don't like the Nito run back. <laughs> it's just a pain. And my, like, so I guess my reasoning why I don't like run backs at all, it just feels like un, like artificial difficulty. Like it's not like an actual hardness. It's like, oh, I know I have less Estus or I have less health that because I had to deal with some BS to fight a boss. But I understand, like, the game kind of, like, is, like, in a Metrovania way. So if you look at, like, Castlevania, like, that's, that's kind of how Castlevania was. Like, you had save points. You had to make your way back to the boss. So they were slight or semi-inspired by Metrovania or Castlevania. But... Elden Ring has the easiest run. Yeah, they the reason they they got to the point I think FromSoft was like, yeah, people don't like the runbacks, and so they were like, no, we're just gonna make it a lot more chill, which I I, I think that's a, the smarter decision in my personal opinion. I think it makes them a little bit more enjoyable, especially sometimes you just want to fight the boss. You don't want to have to deal with the runback. He's right here. I might die. There we go. All right, round two. Don't you dare laugh. Don't you dare laugh. Don't you laugh. Don't you laugh. Don't you laugh. Don't laugh. Don't laugh. Nito, can you walk faster? Oh, fuck, the pillar. Nope. Yep, beautiful combo. Yep. I honestly don't know if it's... Because I'm pretty sure for that attack, it, like, literally, like, pinpoints you. So I don't think you can actually run away from it. At least from, like, all my other runs. But all right. I'm going to keep my word. I'll go uh, get a Divine Club. Mouse, I don't know why you want to hang out right there. Uh, what am I going to need? I'm going to have to... Let's go to... I got to go farm souls so I can buy green Titanite shards. That's what I have to do. Yeah, I would say Elden Ring is the most casual game. You're right, Greg. At the same time, though, it's kind of like, as an adult, I'm like, you know, it's it's kind of like that thing where it's like, oh, you helped me save time to, like, you know, I get to refight the boss. So it's, it's kind of like that nice feeling. All right, let me go down there. Yeah, that's true, Phantom Eve. It, like, it's, it's kind of like the same thing for me, too. Like, when I first did it, I didn't really die to them a lot. But when I started doing challenge runs, oh, ho, ho, ho. Those run back. That's why in the uh, Double Trouble mod, I, I use safe states. Because I was like, I'm not doing this. I can't do this a hundred times. <laughs> I can't keep, like, O and S is fine, right? But they, these big run backs for, like, the Four Kings and uh, 
Nido, Seath. Like, I was just, I got tired. I was like, I can't do this. I'd give it like 10 tries. I'm like, no, no, no. All right. Um, I'm using save states. Like, I, I can't waste all this time just running back to try a boss. When I literally just want to fight the boss. DSG runbacks are misery because no iframes on the fog wall. Really? There's no iframes on the fog wall? They don't make you... Oh, my lord. That is horrible. You're going to hit me, aren't you? Oh, I thought they were going to smack me. Oh, no. Oh, I saw the wolf ring. Yay. I'm actually curious now if it's going to be easier for me to actually just manually kill them or to make them run off the edge. This will be interesting. It's time for the Jesus Club? Correct. Alright, uh, the knights... Nah, I don't want to deal with you. You can run off the edge. Uh, I might be... Yep, that was too soon. So if you walk off too soon, like I just did, you will, uh, he'll, they'll drop down. You actually have to walk off to the ledge. Well, I wasn't paying attention. But sometimes it's easier to do that with them because they can, most of them can, like, almost one-shot you when you don't have armor on. Yeah, man. Let's redo this again. Let's manipulate your AI. Come yeah, on. Come yeah, on. And run in here to your death, good sir. The Demon Souls remake should have had optional removal of bosses runs because they are miserable. Well, at that point, it's kind of like, right, like, they're remaking the game. So it's like, I feel like you would end up, it's kind of like, even like, let, let me be honest. Let's say they, they completely remake Dark Souls in the division they want it. I think they have to keep the runbacks because it just you take away from what the original design was. I think it, like it's just one of the things you have to learn from and then move on. You don't want to change too much of the original product because that's still something that a lot of people care about. So like from a business perspective, right? Not like from a personal perspective. You know, you cannot just shoot the lasers. We we could or magic missiles. We could work things out. He's the most annoying to get to run off the edge. By far. But sometimes he won't do it. Yep, there he goes. Did they get stuck? They can get stuck, and it's the worst. Yep. One of them got stuck. Did I not get the thief to come over? Oh, lord. Yeah, of course, make everything difficult. That was a gamble for a backstab. Nope, I'm in the wrong spot. You know what? I think I'm actually just gonna go for killing them manually. I don't think I'm gonna waste my time with the whole make them run. Because it can be tedious sometimes to try to get the damn mage to want to run up. Yeah, dude, he has like infinite, like, stamp, like just infinite magic to just can spam it nonstop. But I think they're weak enough. I could just one shot him. Oh, that's Scully. Hi, Scully. I need power within. Sorry, buddy. So I'm just gonna see if I could one shot him. This might be faster. You had to roll. Alright, it was a gamble. I went for it. I, I guessed I was going to survive his little dagger. Uh, I should be able to bait out the thief. There we go. Hmm. Oh, hello. I didn't know you got triggered. 
Now that y'all both here, would you like to go off a cliff? Why, thank you. This works. I think this is the better strategy. Kill Magic Boy. Let the other two run off the cliff. Are we sure magic requires intelligence? <laughs> Not always. Not always. Dude, yeah. I wish we could spam all that. That would make things so much easier. Let's see, 9,000. I don't remember how much green Tynite Shards cost, so I'm going to have to probably go for a bit. I do have two Prow Knights. I honestly thought the club was going to one-shot him. I'm a bit more impressed that he survived the, uh... It took two hits to kill him. Alright, so heavy and light is the best way to get him. Come on, big boy. So the reason why I don't go for that guy really back there is he'll de-aggro most of the time. And he's too much of a pain to drag. And he actually gives less than the rest. He only gives a thousand souls. Oh, that works. Hey, you're supposed to fall. That works. Alright. We're almost at it. Part of me doesn't know how much I need. I'm trying to remember. Are they 500 a pop? I could probably Google it. I never farmed that spider around. All I see it on videos. And I'm probably going to try it. It's, dude, it's the fastest way to get, like, souls. And at least at, like, a certain point, right? Like, trying to grind out killing things, it's not usually... It takes a bit longer. No, I didn't think you were going to run. Haha, <laughs> you're stuck by the bush. Gotcha. He should be triggered. I think. Okay, he is. Sometimes he doesn't always come. Sometimes he's like, nah, I'm not going to do it. Or worse, they get stuck. Then it's really bad. And you're like, oh, I have to go get you because I have to babysit. Did he get stuck? Did I open my mouth too soon? Nope, I went too far. That's also the other thing that can happen. If you go too far up to the top, you can fly off the edge. But, the upside to it is, if you do fall off, your souls are right there for you, so you don't really lose a fuck ton. Or you just lose time, really. Unfortunately, FromSoft was like, oh, we're gonna, uh, add physics where it launches you off when you walk on an edge. Because it adds like a slide and it shoots you. You build momentum. Why are you walking? Alright, there we go. Oh, you just found the Citadels? Damn, Greg. Slugs in Blighttown drop five green China shorts. That is true. That is... Oh, got stuck. That's true. Is it faster to grind them that way, though? For that... I forgot. The percentage is... Yeah, it's, it's not... Is it 5%? It's like 5.1 or something. Did he not fall? Okay, there we go. I can't remember. I think the percentage might be... It's either 5 or it's 2.15% like or something like that. It's been a minute since I've had to grind them. But I know for sure. Like, part of me is like... It might be faster to, like, you know, buy them in bulk. But I could be wrong. I also got to buy another club. And I'm... I'm not too sure who sells clubs. Maybe on maybe I'm gonna check Andre. Maybe he sells a club. It's probably not gonna be enough, but part of me thinks I only I'm not gonna upgrade it to like a full holy weapon. I'm just gonna do the plus like the normal like plus five. I think that'll be enough to kill the skeletons. And then I'll switch back to my normal club to deal with Nito. 
I think that's our smartest option. Oh, they're 4,800 and 5,000 from... S oh. That is a good chunk. Uh, do you have a club, good sir? Do you sell a wooden club? You do not. You, you're better than that, apparently. So it's only the undead merchant that sells the club. Or is there only one club? I guess we'll have to find out. Because I am not downgrading this bad boy. Alright. Let's make our way to Undead Merchant to find out. Don't hit me, please. I would appreciate it. Scully and I are on a new adventure. This, he's for the ride this time. He's here just to sightsee. He's not gonna partake in smashing his face into stuff. Yeah, he's got it pretty cheap too. Yeah, okay, good. I had a feeling he had it. I thought I saw it when I saw it that time. Don't do it. Don't poke me, don't poke me. There we go. Hey, buddy. I would like a club. Wherever your club may be. Thank you. Yep. Thank you kindly. Uh, I got one. I'm going to save that. Actually, do you, you sell... I shouldn't, but I'm going to buy a few homer bones. Do you sell homer bones, or is that only the female? That's only the female. Okay, that's fine. Got the wiki up to help you. Just will take a second to find stuff. Oh, thank you, family. I appreciate it. Can't you downgrade the Ocklet Club in Anor Orlando for a Holy Club? Oh, I didn't... Wait, is it a club or is it a large club? I don't, I, for, I can't remember. Because if it is a club, I could have done that. But I do have the club now. Guys, no. Oh, God. That's not good. That was beautifully timed, Archer. Beautifully timed. Gotta make it spicy, I guess. Should've just used the damn homework bow. Engage in Holy Crusade? Yes. With Scully on our side, we'll have our vengeance upon Nito and uh, the Four Kings. The, four, the Nito did take me a good while to beat. I Even though like I got that one part lucky. Yeah, I 100% got sniped. And just keep running, keep running, keep running. We're gonna pop it because I'm scared. You know, I know I have good defense right now, but I just don't trust this area. Where did you put it? Oh my god. That was okay. Oh, that's not cool. Don't block it. I'm not going to make it in time. Nope. Can I have the fire back? Thank you. First a bot and now a stream snipe. Oh yeah, good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, let's warp to. And it's in Orlando, but we want to do the Chamber of Princesses. Why aren't you warping 
on the bonfire above Andre? I thought I did. Did I not? Or warping two. Because I gotta go buy the green Tynite shards. Oh, you're right. I'll, I'll go back. I'll go back. But let me go do the shards and I'll warp back. I'll do it for that. Aha! I had the low ground. I win. Alright, I think I have a good amount. Okay, uh, he... He does upgrade to Divine, but I need green Tynite shards, and Andre doesn't sell green Tynite shards. I think I have, like, one green Tynite shard? Oh, wrong side. Yeah, I have two. But I think I need a total of nine to get the plus five. So, uh, uh the Giants uh, sells green Tynite shards. So I came in here to buy them. And then I'm going to purchase. Oh, -ho, I'm one shy. Why? How, how much souls I need? 4,000 here? I'm going to kill the Sentinels. I'm like one shy. That's horrible. If I just like did one more run of the damn uh thing, and I would have been fine. When am I gonna do the DLC after Nido? I usually try to, cause I know people like it where for like Seif to do the scene for where um where you rescue her before like taking on her and the four kings. Because unfortunately, you have to take her out before you take on the four kings. So usually, I'm going to go after Nito and then DLC. Because I'm pretty sure that's my only options, really. Hi, big boy. I didn't think you had to follow up, big boy. Where are you going? Why are you walking off already? Where are you going? Okay. That, I see how it is. I win, because I do big boy damage, and you do- You also do big boy damage, but I want to be the big boy. Okay. I was hoping he was doing horizontal. Now you do horizontal? You just don't cooperate. That's fine. Do your AOE. I'm gonna go see what your buddy dropped. Damn it. That'd be the halberd. Come on. I'm literally like a few shy. I need like just a little bit. Oh. No, fuck it. I'm gonna go kill the little guy. That's what I'm gonna do. The little, little brain demons. I'll go kill him. He'll probably die in like one hit. I'm not gonna waste my time with that. Murder to get the divine upgrade. Ironic. Yeah, yeah. It's the Holy Crusades. <laughs> Artorias gonna suck probably. Uh, Guardian's not gonna be as bad as you, I think, Alex. Just do the like you can actually run like so. I don't know if many people know this, and I didn't mention it in my last video with Scully. So when he chases you, like when he does his little like mouth grab, like he's going to bite you, you actually can run away. You don't need to roll. You can actually just run and he will not hit you at all. It really comes into that. It, the, I think the part that's going to be hard about the Sanctuary Guardian is his like heat seeking missiles. That now that's that's going to be the hard part. That's not going to be fun. Artorius is going to be the retaliation. But I think maybe with the wolf ring, I might have a chance to not, you know, get sunlock. So we'll see. Alright, we got enough now. And then... We use the homeward bone. Is 
Not where I wanted. I have to keep my promise. Yeah, the lightning's bad. It's really his most annoying thing is the light. Because it does follow. It does have a... It curves on you sometimes, too. And it, like, the ball attack and everything's annoying. Alright, Scully needs booba. So we're gonna give Scully booba. Scully, here's your booba. In your ass. But mostly booba. Say goodbye. Enjoy the view. You'll see your wife in a little bit. Now that we've completed the obligation of that, we can make our way to Undead Parish. The game fucked. No. What happened? Why were we saying no? I missed it. Or that you missed the booba. <laughs> Is that the no? <laughs> Is that what happened to Game Funk? You missed it? Modify. Oh, that's true. I gotta upgrade it to a plus five. Oh, God. So many things I've forgotten. Uh, I don't have any souls, do I? I forgot about that. Oh, I thought you were going to slay the goddess. No, no. I don't even think I can hit her with the club. All right. I'm trying to think what the best option right now is. I either one have to go farm up to buy the Tynite shards because I forgot that you need it to be plus five to modify it to a divine. Or I guess I should go find the Oculet. Is if the Oculet one in An Orlando is that way, then I could just downgrade it, right? And then I can immediately have it. If it is an Oculet club and not a, I mean an Oculet, a cult uh, club, and it should be fine. Because I don't know if I want to, I don't like grind for the souls. Well, maybe if you kill the sentinels, I don't know. Oh, it is a club? Cool, cool. Yeah, then it's probably the better option since I don't have to pay. I should be able to just downgrade it. Which I'm pretty sure it's in the same room with Havel's armor, if I recall correctly. Is it? It's not the, in the mimics chest, right? It's one of the normal chests. Gotcha. Yeah. Sweet. Oh no, Scully! I have to put you away for a second. Sir, I would like a fair fight, but you must come up here. A little further. No, further. Fur that's not further. This is going against everything I'm asking of you. Thank you. Oh, it is in the Mimic one? Oh, it is the Mimic. Alright, cool, cool. I just need to use the Lloyd Talisman. Okay. Bada bing, bada boom. Pretty sure it's this door right here. And we go in. Yep. Wait. Fair fight, says the caveman to the armor knight. <laughs> That's a caveman. I still have rules I follow by. Trying to remember, I think the uh it's you, isn't it? Yeah, it's probably you. Where are you at, Lloyd? Oh, I never realized if you actually look at it very closely, you can see it moving without even like clicking it. Oh. That's all we need. 
Caveman versus actual dragon. Wait, where's the stairs? Was it paying attention? All right, now we got that. We should be able to downgrade it. They breathe? Yeah, yeah. I just, I, I guess I never really paid that close of attention to see the animation. So that is a fun detail that to like, if you don't know, like obviously sometimes for it being out of place, just look at it's like little like a uh, latch moving up and down. You're like, oh, okay. It's a mimic. Warp. Undead perish. Yeah, Ryan, just noticed that. Yep. If the chain next to the chest is not curved, it's also a mimic. Oh, oh it's not. It's not curved. It's also a mimic. Okay, interesting. I never knew that. I kind of ended up just memorizing. Like, oh, that's a. Uh, that's a mimic. That's a mimic. Instead of actually trying to like look for key points. All right. Let's see. Let's go to, I think it's under modifier, right? That you can down it. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. It goes straight to a device. I didn't have, oh shit. I thought the like, uh, occult goes straight back to like a normal. Oh, wow. I, okay. So I legit wasted time. So whoever suggested doing the, uh, occult first, uh, uh was a hundred percent right. And I'm sorry. I was a hundred percent wrong in this decision to grind out. <laughs> You had the big brain. I had the caveman brain. <laughs> All right. Well, that puts it in there. We had the weapon we needed. I just wasted a fuck ton of time. That's fine. It's fine. <laughs> now pray to the bunkers that sell the Scalamino. Yeah. Oh, uh, wait, we need Scully. Scully, where you at? No, that's not Scully slot. That's Scully. Scully. Holy club, please. Thank you. Uh, 109 is not going to be too bad. I don't think it's going to kill the skeletons of one good. Well, no, power within it should. But. Oh, wait, no, no, I'm making a boo-boo. I'm making a boo-boo. I need making a boo-boo. I need to rest at the bonfire. Because FromSoft didn't think it was a wise decision when you warped to that bonfire. You didn't want to be at that bonfire when you died. All right. Boonga boonga time. The holy stick of Moses. <laughs> Uh, oh, that's right. Why do? No, nope, that's fair. I keep for some. My brain thinks every time I get to that curve that I'm at the second position. So like, you go through there, you hit the hole. But I, I every time I go there, I think, oh yeah, this is the one where you walk off to the right. No, it's the next one. My brain does not want to accept that I have to wait to go into the little circle hole for that one to be. Cause this does happen to me all the time. This is like not abnormal. I still do this even after all the hours I have. Thank you, buddy. Ah, of course you're right there. All right, I'm just gonna run. There we go. Yep, I think with plus four will be fine. I don't think I'll need plus five at all for health. Yeah, the giant dog. Yeah. Tomb of the Giants, blind, no light source, rough. Yes, 100%. 100%. Like, I would feel bad for anyone who, like... Because I turned around after my first... Because I went to the catacombs before you should have... And it was hell. And then I started going to the Tomb of Giants, and I was like, no, 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 no. This is too dark. I'm turning around. 
So anyone who braved it and kept going, kudos. Actually, not kudos. That probably was a horrible decision because then you, let's say you make it through, then you find out, oh, there's a big wall that's preventing you from going further. Then you got to find your way all the way back out. Come on. Come on. No fire balls. Oh, I hate pinwheels. I hate pinwheels. Oh, it's a hair short. Oh, well. No, that's true. We can just do that. All right. Now we just gotta. Now this is where RNG is gonna come into play. Whether or not. Uh. Nito's gonna do his stupid little poke attack. Oh. Oh, I rolled. I knew I shouldn't have locked on. I was trying to be more accurate. I'm gonna let him kill me and then I'll use the dark sign when I get back. I was thinking, oh, let me use the lock on system so I don't fuck up. Yeah, yeah, and then I press circle to run and I fuck up because you're uh, automatically roll. All right, dark sign to lose the 2k. That was your first time, Phantom Eve? Oh, no. <laughs> Imagine watching the stream and not leaving a like. Ah, oh, it is what it is. I don't have to. User's choice. Uh, yeah, you did it too, let him cook. Man, this seems to be a recurring theme that everyone did it. Hard part of this run was fighting... Oh, hello. The muscle memory not to roll. Yes, 100% is. Nope, nope, I'm making my mistake. Nope, I'm not gonna do it. Again. Nope, nope. Yeah, like, it's just such a, like, habit of, like, tapping. But I'm pretty positive of the... I didn't, I didn't go behind him fast enough. Yeah, that's what it is. I'm pretty sure, too, the lock-on system really, like, if you tap the circle button, like, just even press it to run, it will automatically roll you for some reason. I only got through because my friend told me, oh, to grab the lantern? Yeah, that's true. If you don't accidentally stumble to the lantern, that makes sense. But I guess a good thing, Ryan, so far, I've kind of, like, you know... I've been doing it for a minute now. Like, I don't really intentionally press it. It's more like a... Like a legitimate accident of like, oh, like, I'll, like, an orange scene and smo. Like, I finished the cutscene and I forgot about input, so I let go of the button not thinking about it. And not actually intentionally pressing it to roll. Or like, in the case of the lock-on system, where it's like, it wants you to roll if you do that. Oh, keeps making that mistake. Oh, well. Yep. Oh, the helmet. Yeah, that's true. That's true. The um, the little light bugs that you can kill in uh, Isolith that give you a little headlamp. And keep going. Keep going. No, sir. No, sir. That is funny to see that his arrow will still miss you, even when you're just running in. Like, I was, like, really expecting, like, because you normally, I rolled there to dodge it. So just to see that you could just keep running into the bone tower and you still can pull it off is just funny. Hey, one of the pinwheels falls. That's great. Ah! No, motherfucker. For the love of God, no one hit me, please. 
You don't need to farm it in the Pyromancy Invader. Drops it for you. Guarantee. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. Huh. All right. That's again. Do they roll forever? Alright, that should be all of them. Switch. Heal up. That's not good. I ran too far. Fuck. Nope. Oh, thank God. Woo! That got scary at the last second, but we did it! Woo! I honestly thought I triggered the big skeleton, but I guess I didn't get close enough. Honestly, at the end, when he started doing his little, like, poke attack, I was like, no! Oh, the Skull Lantern from the Necromancers. That's right. Yeah, yeah. They dropped it. That's true. And we'll get some points. And with that done, that means Hydra time. Yep, power of the holy club. Take out the three skeletons and then just smack away with the normal club on Nido. And I got lucky I didn't get toxic, so. Alright. Here, so we need to make our way down. Yeah, I can't remember. I do this order. I might be wrong in this, but don't you have to save Dusk, then get the pendant? Or, or I usually save dust and then go get the pendant. I don't know if you have it on you if you can just speed up the process, but You think Nito's one giant skeleton that put a bunch of others to intimidate Likes he's a high mind so the tool is for uh... It's possible in that way. I also think he might be like his thing is like I'm not really strong like I but I can control the undead but I think that's usually how necromancers usually are. They're usually supposed to be weak while their minions do all the work. Whereas in Diablo, that's not the case. Your necromancer is still pretty powerful even without the the minions. But yeah, I can 100% see that he's just like, I'm going to collect all these heads and now I'm the biggest one. You have to listen to me now. Wait, where am I? Oh, that's out of habit. I'm going the wrong way. When an autopilot. Bro, it's clear that I watched solo leveling. Yeah, solo leveling. Uh, oh, I've read it. I read all of solo leveling before it even got popular. I was reading it. I was waiting for each episode uh, to come out. I think I was like when there was only like 10 released at the time. Solo leveling is a super good mod, which was very interesting because if you look at the very first chapter of solo leveling, the author had a different idea for where he want the character to go, and then by the end, you can tell he went in a completely different story direction. Which I don't, I don't mind it. I love the story, but it was, it was interesting to see the direction I decided to go to. Okay, that's fine. Oh, no splash? No, I won't say nothing, Greg. I won't say nothing. Yeah, then, yeah, the whole necromancer thing, yeah. Which is kind of funny. Like, there's even another uh, 
Oh shit. I don't remember the name of the manhwa on the top of my head. That it has like a similar concept. But it's a bit different. But it has to do with like is it like something necromancer, something solo necromancer? Something along that line. I think it's solo, but it's something with necromancer in the name. And it's a really good manhwa that I like that I've been reading recently. Yeah, the hydras, you're not gonna want to do your thing where you shoot water. Or do you not know I'm here yet? Y'all don't know I'm here. Okay. That's that's fine. That's fine. I don't know what y'all were looking at, but that's that's fine. I usually try to get the hydras to take these guys out. But the hydras are being a bit Oh, you also, fun fact, the hydras water shots do like curve. I've slowed it down in Premiere to I was pretty sure that's what was happening. Hydra. It's not that hard. Wow, why are you hitting the corner? Okay, the Hydra's being weird. He normally will usually even just shoot right here. He's being like, I'm gonna look in this corner. Hydra, I really don't want to... What are you looking at? What are you so fascinated by? Can you please kill them so I don't have to fight you with them showing up? Because it's not going to go well for me. Alright. One down. We got like one more. I think the other two died. Oh, yep, I knew it. Did you get him? Nope, you did not. Okay, now I got him. I don't think I'm safe there. No, I knew it. Oh, bunga bunga. Oh, I missed. No. Okay. I'm hoping I don't have to d kill all his heads. I think I'm doing enough damage. Come on. Maybe one more hit on the head. The Hydra could be a pain in the butt. I can't see. Where you at? Oh, there's your head. Oh, shit. The, the dust gets me sometimes. I'm so confused. That it's, it's like up so high. All right, cool. I didn't have to do all the heads. That's nice. I remember getting one of those weekly books where you can view up and coming new books and so leveling was on it. Oh, really? Yeah, no, solo leveling is super good. It kind of, like, popped off. It was kind of like, for a while, it was like, no one was really talking about it. And I was like, man, this is so good. And all of a sudden, it blew up. I was like, oh, okay, there it goes. Yeah, the Hydra... The only thing annoying about the Hydra is, is that one of his heads likes to stay near the damn edge of the water. And that's the only part that bothers me. Or the fact that he'll get, like... When you do fist weapons, he likes to get stuck in a certain direction. That gets annoying. Plus, they decided that they were going to make the dust cloud like last way too long, so you can't see half the time where he's at, or where the head's at. And their hitboxes are not good. When I had to do it with Scully, it was not fun. Like, it was annoying trying to hit them, because Scully's hitbox is small, whereas, and their hitbox on their head is actually small. Like, you can whiff it a lot. Like, it doesn't go up their entire neck. It's just a small portion of it. So that wasn't very fun. Oh, yeah, cosplay. That's right. We're doing Hercules. That's right. <laughs> well, oh, shit. I thought he just spawned me. If I quit out and come back in, does it happen? I don't remember. I thought they would just be waiting there. Okay, there we go. Wait, power within.
Whoa, one shot, baby. Oh, yeah. Dust, my dear. All right. I don't have any homework bones, but I gotta go get the pendant now. That is very true. Hercules, weirdly buff hobo. Yep. Oh yeah, on the way for the rock to the right. Yep, yep, Greg. I did that. I actually had to do that on my very f uh, first run with the fist weapon uh, with the Cestus. I had to like wait on the rock to like nip him. I tried to make sure with Scully though. I tried to get all the like the head before it does that damn curve. I tried to knock out each one. That was annoying. Actually, I wonder if going to the bonfire that way would be faster. No, uh, uh, I don't remember. No, I'm not gonna chance it. I don't remember. Maybe. I don't know. Fuck, I'll chance it. I don't go this way at all. But I know it could be faster to get to that, like, the bonfire than trying to run back. Because I don't have any homework bones. I use them all. Damn, how big is this ladder? Jesus. Oh yeah, with the skull lantern? Yeah, I don't think- I think I brought it up with the Cestus. I think I did. I, could, I don't- I, it's been a minute since I made the video. Oh, they are that way? That's what I was worried about. Thank you. Thank you, Ryan. Part of me was I was I didn't know if they were there or not. I couldn't remember if you could get there without dealing with them. My bad. Thanks for the heads up. Ugh. All right. Uh, what is the fastest? Probably going to Undead Parish. Yeah, Undead Parish is faster. This is like the only drawback. I don't recall. I probably should have gotten the pendant while I was at Seath. I just don't remember. I remember one time trying to do the quit out and it didn't work. And I had to go back to a bonfire to get her to show up. But, or to get the portal to show up. But I could be wrong in that regard. I probably should just for... Shits and giggles have gotten it when I was there. It's uh, the Duke Archives. Actually, thinking about it now, I don't remember if I rested at the... Uh, no, okay, I did. I think I did. Oh, it's finicky? Oh, interesting. No, yeah, the cats are hard. They're, I avoid them at all costs. I don't go near them. Around and dodge. Just keep running, just keep running. I think I might have enough for a level. I also, uh, I don't think, no, Nito doesn't give you a soul that you can actually use. <laughs> Oh, going up, going up, going up. Level up. Yeah, yeah. 70. I don't know why I double tapped out. Duke Archives? Hell yeah. That's not the spot I wanted. Uh, now nah, I'm gonna do Anna Orlando. I don't want to deal with all the bullshit. I killed the boards too, so I don't, yeah, that's right. I killed the boards, so Anna Orlando is faster. It's weird that they put such a bad enemy in the only one spot, even though they know they're more than. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah.
Uh, are they- were the cats not relative to the other dude, uh, the other cat? The one where you joined the Force Hunters? I just thought they had something to do with him, but I could be wrong. There could be a Vati video on it, for all I know. I think that's how you pronounce his name, right? It's Vati? Yeah, the cat that gives you the covenant? The, uh, uh, shit, I can't think of it. The Alice in Wonderland cat? I'm very positive that's what they were inspired by was the Alice in Wonderland cat. And... Rest of the bonfire, just in case I die. Cheshire Cat? It also could be a type of cat they could have just been inspired by. But. And pull the lava crunk. Alright, I'm gonna have to deal with all these people. Come on. Double combo! Two for one! Can't remember. Okay, there's no more there. Okay, you're still over there. Come on. My turn. Hee <laughs> hee. He's still charging his damn attack. I want him to do the dance, because if you run up there while he's doing it, he will snipe you. Dance, boy, dance. Or not notice me, wanted to do. Nope, 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 nope. See, told you. He's gonna snipe me. Haha, you thought you could shield bash me. I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna try to one-shot the crystal dude. Are you still doing? Okay, calm down. Of course he didn't get one shot. And we got the pendant. Oh, son of a... I didn't think they noticed me. Well, that's fine. Whatever. Yeah, the Duke Archives with all the crystal dudes, yeah. No, not fun. There's just so many of them. It's just more annoying than hard. No! Why did you make it? That's not fun. Just get one-shotted. Yeah, dude, I don't blame you, Greg. Don't blame me. Now, hear me out. That's only 4,000. I'm not going to get him. Really? The other big hacks don't have any? Well, that's interesting. See, I got that. So we can go back to Undead Parish. And we can take on the DLC. And then I get to deal with the Sanctuary Guardian. Which probably will be hell, but... Or we'll get lucky and I do a lot of damage. Be oh. I guess the smart thing would be to go upgrade the the club to plus 15. Oh shit. Wrong button. I don't have any Titanite chunks. How many more Titanite chunks do I need? Uh, do I want? No, I don't really want them. If it gets bad, I'd rather- because I can still warp there if I decide I need to go grind. I'd rather go try the boss. You know, you weren't supposed to hit me. It wasn't very nice.
And just keep running and running and running. Dark root garden. Neil. Let him quit. Go in the bed, man. You have a good night, man. Thanks for coming out. I appreciate it. Just keep running, keep running, keep running. Ah, yeah. There we go. Uh, I don't think I need to talk to Elizabeth, so we'll be fine. I think I just need a pendant and then I can go get manhandled. Running, keep running. Fun part walking through. I probably should have grabbed the ring back at the uh, uh, Undead Asylum to be able to run through the water. I always forget about it. Keep going, and you can make it. Come on, we're almost there. All the running, just to get there. Uh oh, that would've been bad. And we get to watch ourselves get manhandled for a second. Ugh, bonfire. Uh, maybe I should check. I haven't checked the repair in a minute. Thinking about it. Oh, nope, they're good. I don't have any- actually, I can't repair it. I don't have any souls. Oh well. Alright, time for the Guardian. Alright. We'll see how bad this goes. Oh, son of a bitch. Uh, I forgot. I need to look at his direction. I thought if you just keep running, you don't get hit. Maybe I remember that wrong. Oh, well. I'm just going to keep running back in. I am more curious of the amount of damage that I'll do to him. Uh, that's what I'm... Because he doesn't have, like, an insane amount of health. I'm pretty sure his health is only, like, 2,000. I think he has less than Quaylag. Okay, so that can be dodged. That cannot be dodged. Hmm. I thought you can like run underneath him when he dives. Hmm. I need to look up his look up at him and see what he's doing instead of staying down. Oh, yeah, it, someone just had to just get lucky and they are playing a lot of hours to figure out the DLC. Oh, okay. Let's try again. Yeah, probably so, Ryan. You're probably right. But someone, someone did have to be the first. Or... FromSoft leaked it, one of the two. So that will guarantee hit me. That's interesting. Ow. 
I'm gonna get hit. What are you doing? Oh, okay. So close. Oh no, I didn't get to the side. Okay, but that's that's two hits. Two hits is half health, so that means we only need four hits. That's not bad. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna try again. I just gotta get lucky that he does. I'm so. I guess because I normally roll when he does that big slam, that I wasn't used to the. Uh, he doesn't have no. Uh, oh no. Nope, that wasn't smart enough. No, his tail! I was one hit away! <laughs> I didn't think he was gonna do it. I thought he was gonna jump. <laughs> oh well. Just- oh man. Now I really want to go get plus 15, just because, like, I know if I was at 15, it, it, the damage, the damage would be insane. Oh, good sir, that was a magnificent hit, because now I'm gonna die. How? Wow. Okay. I don't know what you're aiming at, but I'll take it. 900! Hear me out. Do it again. Oh, boys! It's been done! Easy peasy lemon squeezy! Thought you would it be bad. Big boy damage. You go unga bunga. Four hits, dead. Oh, y'all on y'all on D uh, Dark Soul Two talk right now. I missed the whole conversation. All right, let's uh, repair my club. Uh. Some levels. A level. It's not even doing anything. Well, it gives me defense, so I'll take it. it I guess it's maybe a, a chance of survivability. Uh, shit, I gotta go farm Titanite Chuck Snaps. I honestly, from this point, if I'm taking on Notorious, Calamine, and Manus, I'd rather not deal with the headache of that. Uh, I'm trying to think. Dark rates or Sentinels. Oh. I might do Sentinels just so I don't have to run back so much. Yeah, I'll do Sentinels. Thank you for being a <laughs> Yeah, the bottomized uh, Guardian.
All right. Go farm some sentinels real quick. Hopefully I can get the chunks. I'm at 13. So I think that's what, three and four? No, no, no. I should only need four Tynite chunks because 14 and then I have the Tynite slabs. So I only need four chunks, right? If I remember my math. Uh, let's see. Got to change up our ring. Maybe the sneak attack here will work out well for me. Maybe not. Good, sir. Oh, the archer. I forgot about the archer. Oh. I was hoping it would do, like... Maybe I should need to do heavy into light light. To kill him faster. Also, I need to pop humanity. I forgot to do that as well. I... Did I not rest out of place? Oh, son of a... Chamber of the Princess. 8% chance? Yeah. I... Th I can't remember if Sentinels have it, like, a little bit hard than, uh... Dark rates or dark rates have like a slight percentage higher. I know they're both in the eight percent, but I, I, I could be wrong. It might both be exactly eight percent, but I thought for seeing maybe one that was like eight point something, but I could be wrong. Yeah, Drakes. No, that Drakes are not fun for the scales. That was miserable for uh to get the achievement. That was not fun. All right. Oh yeah, humanity. Not gonna forget. I need to increase my odds. So at least we will be a little bit faster. No worries, Greg. No worries. All right, I was right. Heavy hit to light hit. Dead. Yeah, I have to deal with the archer. Wombo combo. Oh, you coming? You coming? You're debating it. Oh, I didn't kill you? There we go. You want to give it to me. You want to give it... No, okay. That's fine. No, you're not wrong. It seems, though, so far, Greg, if I, like, keep just running circles around them, it won't be too, too bad. It seems like I, when I ran circle, he ended up, uh... <clears throat> Slamming his shield down, which gave me a good opportunity to get him. Which is probably not going to always be the case, but yeah. Yeah, Ryan, I usually do too, but part of me is like debate. Because you obviously have more, right? Like the, the quantity of rates within the area. It's just, I, I can't decide whether which run back's worth it at the moment. But I'm going to test it for a bit. If it keeps... If the Sentinels don't give me what I need, I'll, I'll switch it up to New Londo and go for the rates. Just because my odds increase because just the, the mass amount of numbers of them. You're not wrong. They could want. They could get me. They. I probably could. They probably do more damage than the Sentinels. To be honest. Oh, they're both eight percent. Interesting. I only need four. I only need four. What you gonna do? Oh, I didn't think you were doing a second one. Oh, I didn't know you were... Oh, that's not working out what I wanted. How? What hit me? Oh, it went all the way back? Wow. You're not being very fun to farm right now. Oh, wait. Maybe I could do this. Maybe I can abuse the stairs.
Aha! There's a weakness. There's. There we go. You want to give me something? Please. Be the chunk. Okay. I see how it is. Humanity? Yeah, I used the- I think I used them all. I only have five. Unfortunately, I don't have enough to get ten. I could go farm. Oh wow, you changed your mind of what you were gonna do. Oh, what are you dropping? Sentinel, my man, can you give me a Tynite trunk, please? Or is there like, is there any easier ones for me I can go get? Probably. I'm trying to think. I know the the Black Knight near Undead Parish near the boar. Oh, I fell. Oh, oh that's fine. Whatever. Hit the shield. There we go. So, no, no worries. Sorry, things long. Have an 8% chance to drop. While the Drake, the rates have an 8.47% with a 0.3% chance to drop two chunks. Oh, okay. So the rates are better. Oh, wait. I thought it was only the Royal Sentinels that drop Tynite Chunks, is it not? Do all s Sentinels drop Tynite Chunks? I don't know, with that 8.47 though, it might be worth it for the rates instead, instead of doing Sentinels. No Royals only? But I thought the ones outside the gates aren't royals. I thought they were just normal sentinels. Am I wrong in that? Okay, so royals are only O and S? Yeah, that's okay. That's what I thought. Yeah, I'm gonna go try the race. Maybe my odds with them will be better. How much poise do rates have? No clue. Uh, no, nah, I'm not gonna do it. I'll risk it for the biscuit. Yeah, without rolling, it's gonna be about me pairing them. I'm gonna have to, like, be... I actually need to be on point, like, last time where I died. If I get parried them, I think they'll die in one shot. Sorry, Skelly, I gotta put you away. The only bad thing is, though, is the run back. It's, I don't have any homeward bones to abuse right now, which I guess I should have done that. I probably should go stock up, but... Gotta lock in? Yeah. Race can also drop slabs you could have given to Framp to eat if you didn't drop... Oh, okay. Yeah, but I guess they had those slabs. Yeah, that's true. If we they ended up dropping, I could do that. Because I will need one, though, for the 15. Let's see. Fun part's going to be getting past the ghost. Let's go. Up and up I go. There, and I gotta pull the lever. Why can't I pull- Oh, he's already up. Oh, no, move! That's not what I want you to do. There we go. I didn't even realize I was already up. I'm going to try to abuse the stairs. Okay, one.
Nope, don't poke. I don't want the dark hand. Doesn't that have like the lowest drop rate? Ah. Y'all are no fun rates. <laughs> Literally, I was like, I got excited. Like, oh, for sure it's gonna be a chunk. But nope. Yeah, different type of drop rate that I want in that moment. <laughs> oh, ghost. What? Oh, no. Why are you there? Are there no, like, is there by chance any, like, tie night chunks I can just pick up? Oh, there's a cracked red eye. I was hoping it was a tie night chunk. Oh, no. No, I want the downstairs. You get to have the upstairs. I got the rhythm going a bit. Come on. Oh, you bastard. I know there's another one over here. Oh, there you are. Oh, no, I missed it. I'll time bad. Oh no, it's a grab. No. There we go. Drakes, you see nothing. Please. Thank you. <laughs> One down, three to go. I know there's another one up here. There's like two. There's like one in the shack and the one outside the shack. Where you at? Come on. I see you. Mother, what are you doing? Jeff. Oh, I am Jeff. Carl. Thank you. Not cooperating. Come on, be a gent. Okay. Uh, I think I'm back at where I started. Also, backstabbing works too. Really? Oh no, don't you dare poke. Oh, I guess now I get to run back. Because I don't have any homer bones. Uh, it's this way. No, that dark wraith was like, I'm not about it. Thank you. Appreciate it. That was very nice, but it is what it is. Madam. Oh, no, no, that is the stairs. I never had to go backwards. It's been a minute. I usually stock up on homeward bones. No. Y'all know long claws. I think we need... Th there is a Snuggly rubbish... Oh, okay. We could do that as well. The rubbish from Snuggly. I can go grab the rubbish real quick. I need... We think... I think we need three more so the rubbish would give us two then i could technically go kill the black knight which give me three is there another black knight that gives a tie knight trunk or another area that i haven't got in a tie knight trunk then i think i got all the ones in sin's fortress besides that one um 
giant that I didn't kill. I think I kill. I, there's one of them that I didn't kill, but don't you have to jump to it to get to the other one? And I'm afraid if I jump, I might roll. I guess depending on how, how, how high the jump is, you won't roll. I don't know. Yeah, because I think I have one chunk right now. If I'm right. We have one chunk. So I need three more. If I if I remember correctly to get it to uh plus fourteen. Guess while we're here with all of this, I'm gonna use it. Why am I not buying the transient curse? I just don't deal with the ghost. I just run away. I don't just don't deal with them. That's my usual method, is just I ignore them. I just never found any reason to actually, like, you know, deal with them. I like, sometimes I will do it if I feel like it's a better setup, but... In this case, I don't think it's too, too necessary. There's static drops of chunks in new Londo ruins if you haven't already picked them up. Oh, I didn't know that. No, I haven't. Oh, shit, where? Oh, God, it's gonna be that type of game of finding them, though. I checked somewhere in New Londo, but don't know where it has one. Yeah, I think that's the issue is I don't, I don't know where it is either. I never, I don't think I ever did the chest to go get them before. I'm not aware of where they're at. But I'm going to go buy some more homeward bones, just in case. Just to speed things up a bit. And then I'm going to go grab the rubbish homeward bone back to the bonfire. And then trade off with Snuggly to get the Tynite chunk, which will leave me with two. I, th I still think the best option is for me to go kill the Black Knight. I could be wrong. Maybe it'll take longer to get to him. I don't know. I'll also buy that while I'm here. Why not? Uh, we'll do 15. Oh, that's true. Oh, oh man, but I gotta all, I gotta all the way to the hollows. Oh, I hate going down to the hollows. Oh, restore the cake? Yeah. But then I lose one, hum then I'll lose a humanity though. I think after we, we don't need the luck anymore, we, we'll get the ass bag. Can we not? Good sir. Oh, it's not. I need to be here. That's right. Go up there. Nope. Miss. Good aim on your behalf. Oh, you didn't want to be a triple combo? Go get the rubbish. I know that's not the rubbish, but it's over the next spot. Nope, a little too slow. Got him. Rusted iron ring while visiting snugly. The wear ring to get to great hall. That's true. Trade it with Snuggly, and we'll have two, and then three for the Black Knight. Uh, for some reason, I thought you could warp to the Undead Asylum. Maybe you can't. Oh. Oh well. I go.
And go up. Time for parkour, you're right. Yep. Gotta run as fast as possible, not to mess up. And as I say it, I mess up. That's like the downside of not being able to jump or roll. Like you're odd, like you have like a chance of not making it. Because the, the game's not gonna push you off uh, like fast enough. Hi, Patches. You sorry fool. You sorry you fool. Yeah, Michael from the office, yeah. Parkour! Hardcore parkour! And... Oop. Ah, shit. There has to be a... Like, I must have to run off that point to make it. The weird difficulties of not rolling. So I know if I jump, I will roll, not one for sure. You sorry, fool. You're just gonna repeat that line every time? Could not be the chosen. Yeah, I did it without the jump already. It is possible, you have to hit it on a certain point. Oh, roller rolling's easier than jumping? Yeah, that makes sense to me, uh... Punk Geeks. I bet I can't roll though. It's, there's no rolling in this run. I have to run off. How did I do it the first time? We I got to the stray demon, so the stray demon was like the third boss I did, and I didn't have any issues. So there's a chunk in the ruins when you're in the water with the wraith, kill it, then. It's up the stairs, out of the water, on the right behind the illusionary wall. Oh. Yeah, but if I do jump it, though, that means 10,000 souls go bye-bye. But yeah, I can do it. But I'm pretty sure, from my memory, you you won't squat. It's a, it's a roll afterwards. Because sometimes when you jump, you roll afterwards. And the second I roll, I'm going to die. I'm going to have to do it again. How on earth am I going to beat bosses? Well, I've beaten a good... I beat most of them so far without rolling. I actually just beat the Sanctuary Guardian not that long ago without rolling. It's it's not fun in a way. It's, it's a lot harder. It's fun in a weird way. It's more fun like, ah, I figured out the puzzle. But like, you know, it's, it's still masochistic. You kind of have to deal with the pain. Oh, that's bullshit. Anything for the fans. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You sorry. I don't know why. I usually I'm not, don't you struggle usually that much with running off of it. Or at least it didn't feel that hard the first time I did. I think I did on my first try, if I remember correctly. I don't know why it doesn't want to work for me now. Or I'm not hitting that gravity just right to, like, fling me. So the issue is that I'm pretty sure... Wait, oh, camera. Oh, I need to go that way. That if I jump, he's not going to squat. He's going to roll. So when you... For some animations, when you jump, you'll end up rolling afterwards. I think if you're high enough, you won't roll. But the second I roll... If I do roll, because this is a no roll... Like, there's no rolling in this run... I have to use the dark sign to lose all my humanity and all my souls. So that's why I haven't been even attempting the jump to retain what I have. I'm trying to think of what I need to do. Why? I guess I'm... Mm, part of me now thinks it's my camera. If I'm aiming it down, maybe I should aim it up.
sorry, fool. You could not be the chosen one. But I'll get it eventually. This is gonna be the thing where it's harder than Ornstein and Smo at this point to make the stupid jump while walking off. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's the gamble, right? Do I want to lose two, uh, ten? Well, not just ten thousand. I'll lose my humanity as well if I, if I remember correctly. So not only am I losing ten thousand, I'm also losing six humanity. Ha ha, lads! I did it. <laughs> See, it's possible. <laughs> you jump before quit before rolling that's a good call but that would be really hard but i made it so we don't need to worry about it yeah i had a feeling I, i'm pretty sure i remember like because i remember doing it often enough that the character rolls too raise the runoff yep yep Uh, oh, that's sh no. They they do get triggered when you go to Scully, I think. Not Scully. Uh, Snuggly. Nope, he noticed me. Yep. Why? Why did I do heavy? Oh, run away. Nope. Whoop! I get to do it again, lads. I get to do it again. Kane, you should make a stream music playlist. I, I thought about doing that, yeah. I need to. But like, I also need to figure out more about OBS and doing that separate audio track and stuff as well. So it's not mix matching with the, uh, the game audio on the desktop. But I forgot the damn... Oh, fuck. Why am I being stupid? I, like, had a brain fart. I could have just quit out and reset the mobs. That was being stupid of me. I wasn't thinking in that moment. I was doing... I was in caveman mode. There was no thought at all. Nope, it has to be more up on the edge. Really? Even if you have all Havel's armor, it still staggers you? Sorry, wow. You could not be the chosen. Come on. I'm gonna try to tilt the camera up. Uh, like, the game's weird sometimes, like where your character goes in a direction with even just the camera angle. No, I went too far to the left because I wasn't looking. I'm trying to remember what I did the first time. There's, there has to be a way for me to repeat it. I'm not too sure how if there's a particular spot that I'm walking off that's launching me enough. Because I'm definitely running long enough. Or at least I think I'm running long enough to have the momentum to go. You could not be the chosen one. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Damn now. Why does it do that? Why? Just let me be on it. I was literally like on the edge and it's like, no. Physics from soft physics. Physics. All right, I'm. Oh, oh, nope. Part of me wants to gamble to jump now, but the quit out. Oh, it's all right. I did anyways. Oh, oh not that one. Y'all can kill me. So it doesn't matter now. I get to try it. I accidentally tapped the, the B button. So no more souls. No more humanity. Now nah, I do feel like a sorry fool.
You won't roll from the jump if you let go of the stick before you land? Really? I did not know that. I'll give it a shot. Alright. So, go for the jump. It's okay. I'm just going to miss the jump. That's fine. Only in Dark Souls 3. Oop, that, that could be an issue. Well, either way, at this point, I already have zero humanity and uh, uh, souls, so. We could find out. We could test. We could do theory testing. That's going to be ingrained in everyone's head. That's true. It was a big enough fall that I didn't. Yep, nothing to lose. Time to test. You're right. You're right, Phantom Eve. You're right. And that's how we learn, and then everyone else who does... Who... If they do choose to attempt this run, get to know. Alright, I let go. Oh, he's right. If you don't hold forward, he won't roll. Or, I went far enough that I had a long fall. I wanted to. But I'll take it. That makes life easier. Confirmed to, yep, confirmed to be true. Yeah, 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 yeah. Skull no, don't talk to me right now. Whoa. Wait, why'd I have the souls? Okay. I will get rid of the souls after I deal with Scully. Not Scully. Snuggly. Snuggy? Snuggly. The bird. I'm surprised that I did use the dark sign. I'm surprised that... Hmm, I guess you have to have them on you for the dark sign to remove it. You're right, it could just be some creature in a nest. You're not wrong. Alright, and I have to use the dark sign because it did not get rid of my souls. So. Nah, I'm not going to do the iron ring. I sided against it. I'm going to turn on the light real quick. It's getting a bit dark in the room. Okay, we have that. So we know... We know for sure there's a guarantee another chunk right at uh, the ruins. And then we have the Black Knight. So let's go back to the ruins. And then we'll deal with the Black Knight. Snuggly with the crows. Yeah, that's true. She's a crow. That's right. Oh, our tiny version of the weird crow people. That's a good call. I didn't even think about that. It's just a massive hallucination the entire time. Is it kind of like the the Pokemon? Uh, I'm going to blank on it. The uh, creepy pasta where like Ashes was in a coma because he got hit by lightning, and everything was just happening in his head, and that's why he's ten the, like the entire time. Why hasn't the crest fallen gone crazy yet? I don't know. He doesn't always go crazy. Well, I think. He has to, you either have to, I don't know if you have to talk to him, or he has to get annoyed by, uh, the noise or something for him to want to leave and then go hollow. But no, most of my runs, I don't ever see him. So, okay, if I remember correctly, the tie nut chunk that's in the chest was in that first area, right? The Like, the very first little section? Yeah, 
And we keep going, keep going. Out the way. Love off. Oh, oh, I'm at the... That's true, I'm not two-handing. Yep, the caveman who can't talk is saying lies to the Oonga Booga. Correct, apparently... If you... Yeah, if you just apparently just don't talk to him, he will, uh... He won't do it. Why do you go back up? Alright. Nah, I was a little too late. Nope, he got he got the stun on me. When he hit me, I was like, oh fuck, I was a little too uh late in the parry. New Londo might be your least favorite uh punk keeks. Yeah, I could see it. It's not fun dealing with all the ghosts. The ghosts really get it for me. The dark rates don't bother me too much. The ghosts bother me. Them going through all the walls is very tedious. Very annoying. So left down the stairs is an invisible wall. Okay. I'm pretty sure. Alright. I'll probably have to take out the rates first to make sure I don't get killed by them. Because I would like to find it, but I'm pretty sure I need to kill them off and not be panicking. Yeah, that's true. I think they could have easily have had another bonfire there, but they're like, nope, you're going to do runbacks from uh, Fire Link Shrine. Brad, yo, what's up, man? Yeah, it's not, yeah. I, I don't disagree with you. The runbacks are not fun. I think that's what adds more to it, right? Like, if there were more checkpoints, I don't think a lot of it would be annoying. Because you'd be like, oh, okay. But it's like, they literally like, now you gotta do a super far run back. Like, it's not, uh, it's like, it's not short to get to the Fort Kings. Like, it's a good little chunk of time. It's probably long. It's probably, no. Nido and the Fort Kings probably have the longest run back. I don't think Seath is as long. Or is it? They actually all might be long, thinking about it now. Yeah, even Beta Chaos has a good... Yeah, they all have really good runbacks, thinking about it. It's a good chunk of time to get to each one. Huh. Oh, because I wasn't paying attention. Okay. And again. Actually, shouldn't it be up? Yeah, cool. Madam. Oh, why? Why does your hitbox literally have to cover it? Why do they put you right there? That's just so annoying. Your hitbox literally covers it enough that I can't go through. Yeah, man. I really wish they would have allowed you to be able to, like, at least in the DLC, to allow you to buy Tainite Trunks, but you can't buy Tainite Trunks from anybody, because I'd be like, oh, this would be so nice. I could just buy them. I don't have to go on a wild goose chase or farming to go get some chunks. But I guess they didn't want it to be that easy to max out your weapon, so... It makes sense. It makes sense. Come on, come on. Let's do it, let's do it. Alright, gotta run through, make the thing. I just spent the past 30 minutes on one shit encounter in Sakura. Oh, yeah. Hey, man, it's how it goes. Sometimes that's just how it goes. This is like with me, what? Whoa. What, O and S was, what, two hours? 
I really do need to go look because I still have the footage. I need to go check to see how long that actually took me to beat Ornstein and Smo. I am curious. So no, none of the other bosses have come close. All right, for the love of God, please. Let me in. You're so annoying. Oh, no, you grabbed me? Oh, Well, at least he's out the way. Stupid ghost. Alright, don't fuck up. Wait, did they not notice me? Okay, he just, he took a minute. It looks like only one. Uh, Die Nitra? Oh yeah, we only need one more. <laughs> All right, I was really hoping. Oh, you pokey mother! You know what? I'm gonna go. Ah. Uh. Can you make it down here? No, you get stuck. What is he gonna do? Oh, you... S oh, no. Oh, my God. I never... I never fight these things. I don't... I didn't realize they have so much health. It's like one HP away. All right, there you go. All right, so I still got two wraiths to deal with. He doesn't see me, so that's good. Oh, nope. He saw me. Rums off backstabs. There we go. Spin the win. Spin the win. Tie night trunk. Okay. I got my hopes up. Okay, there should be one more. Don't you see me? I'm pretty sure there's one more in this area. Yeah, I think he's in this hall door. Yep. Come on. Let's go to the stairs. Come on. We're going to play it safe. Oh, why is it so slow? Mother fuck me in the ass. I was expecting to do his little poke. I was expecting the overhead. I don't know, I might get the drops before I even get to the illusionary wall. Actually, I should just go for the Black Knight now, actually. It would be the smarter choice. Is it faster to go that way to get to the Black Knight? Actually, I don't even know what the fastest way to get to the Black Knight is. I'll do it this way. Alright. Go kill the Black Knight and we'll have the final chunk. And I'll finally be done with this stupid grinding. Yeah, this right. Yeah, well, I got. Yeah, I had a feeling with how the way it was going.
Especially with me, like, I just easily, uh, like, getting stun lock. I probably, at that moment, what I should have done was put the, um, wolf ring on so I didn't get stun locked. Because that's the real reason why I died was being stun locked. Because I have the serpent ring on right now and not something that prevents me from actually getting hurt. This is a gamble. Got it. I win. Let's get that plus 15 for big boy damage. Son of a... Because I didn't rest at the damn thing. Uh. Oh, do I plan on making cons for other soul Souls titles, Ron? Yes, I do plan on doing it. Currently, I've just been doing Dark Souls 1 because I, just, I know it so well. So I know I can get through it faster than if I do Dark Souls 3. But what I'll do is I'll start putting it in. I'll do it after this one. After I make this video, I'll put a poll in. And I'll let y'all I'll let y'all decide. I won't keep going on it. If y'all want like Dark Souls 3 or Dark Souls 2, I'll let y'all pick. But it's more important than what y'all want than with me just going through it. And we need to reinforce weapon. And club. Done and done. Plus 15. Yeah, our Taurus has no idea. How does a caveman have the chance to tell Andre to upgrade his club? He just points that stick and Andre knows. <laughs> Andre's like, I got you. And where you at? No, yes, I think it's the sanctuary. Finally, the true bunk. Yep. Uh, I don't think... I'm trying to think what I could do. Nope, wrong one. That would've been bad. Do that. Uh, I could get the... I don't even know if it's... I might have to kill Elizabeth for her mushrooms. I don't know if I want to go through her whole storyline. Yeah, I'm not doing it. I'm not going through her storyline. I'm gonna be a bad person. I'm going to use that for the four kings. I'm going to use the mushroom with the wolf ring, and I'm just going to DPS them down and not move. <laughs> and I'll be healed the entire time. Which, I don't know if y'all know this. The Elizabeth mushrooms, which you can get more, uh, whoop, greatly restore HP for a limited duration. I think it's 30 seconds, if I recall. And it's super good. It was very useful when I uh, for the Skull Lantern run with the uh, Havel's Armor. I'm trying to remember, I go this way. Just keep running, just keep running. Yes, if I. Uh -huh, oh, I wasn't paying attention. Yes, but seeing a, the talking mushroom is not normal for cavemen. Not normal at all. Cayman do not like big mushroom. Hi, Calamie. See you in a little bit. Calamie's actually going to scare me more than Artorias, I think. I just feel like if I don't do enough damage to him, he's going to like spin or something, and I'm not going to be able to dodge the spin. And dodge, 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 dodge. Keep running, keep running.
Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Yeah, I made it. I need to go activate the other one. First playthrough, killed Elizabeth on sight. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Poor Elizabeth. At least you got the mushrooms right away. I have a feeling I didn't rest at the bonfire, but oh well. Good day to you, sir. I have some people to boink. Bonk. Boink. Bonk. Wait, was that Gwyn area? I never played the... This is the, uh, like, the guard, or the sanctuary garden, or, like, the area prior to all the, or the mid of the chaos happening, if I recall correctly. I'm not too caught up on the lore at the moment. Yeah, Calumny would to be T-Rex, the caveman. And we get to watch the cutscene, because it's a good cutscene. Thank you, Punk Geeks. Thank you. I uh, hopefully it's not too bad. I'm I'm trying to think of I I think for sure if I can punish his lunge attack because I think you don't have to roll. I think you can run diagonal to it. I think anything else I'm I'm fucked. I might be able to outrun his uh big jump attack. Now if he oh god how am I gonna dodge that that part? Nope, very far, Taurus. 600? Okay. So, good call on the wolf ring. I'm getting hit. Oh, that's lucky. Don't do it. Okay, I can't run, outrun it. Fuck. Oh, didn't run fast enough. That's on me. Damn. It's like sometimes I can get it off, sometimes I can't. Damn. Why is that his hitbox keeps getting me? Oh, there it is follow up not bad that was a pretty good first go uh it does seem though i need to get luckier or better with the timing of his jumps to run underneath him it does seem sometimes though his hitbox almost pulls me like he gets right on top of me and it like pushes me there and it's very interesting but not bad i don't think it'll be might not be too many tries the damage is good with the 600 Any rest here? Yeah, it's gonna be punishing the jumps. I, I need to bait him out. The issue was there was that I kept like I had a good run for a second where I would heal and then be had enough time to get under him, but I just couldn't get the right point. It, it seemed like his hitbox and mine just kept wanting to have that unfortunate collide where I was getting slightly nipped. Gotta make it back now. Just gotta keep making it. Oh yeah, his spam roll. I'm hoping he doesn't do it. I know for sure if that happens, I'm not dodging. Well, no, I don't think you can dodge it. You might be able to circle it. I don't know. I don't want to find out. 
It would not be fun to find out. Yeah, I could I could go buy charcoal pine resin. I could. Uh, I don't know. Does he sell charcoal pine resin? Or I guess I would have to go back to the female merchant. Yeah, because I can use I can use charcoal pine resin. I've just been forgetting about it. I've just been doing so much damage. I just don't think about it. Oh wait! Oh my God! He got like right on top of me. Yeah, but I'm not dodging that. I can't see. Yep, that was about right. I don't know what happened on that one. It's like sometimes you can run. Maybe I stopped too soon. Maybe I need to run for it. Because I'm trying not to run too far. Because if I run too far, I can get too good of a distance between me and him. Oh, Elizabeth sells gold pine resin. Oh, but I need. Char I can't use gold pine. I can only use straw coal. It has to be fire. We agreed upon yesterday that uh, cavemen would not be a fan of lightning, they're, but they're okay with fire. But I'll figure it out. A oh, perfect shot. Yeah, it's going to be more about just getting that first start off if I can get him to do the jump and then just get him in a good pattern. Because it's, it's looking like, what, five or six heavy hits? So I think I got him four times? And it looked like he wasn't too far from dying. But that's if power within lasts long enough. Plus, I might have a good opportunity, too, if uh, I get him to... Which, I'm surprised. I got him more than halfway, but he didn't go into his... I think I got him, like, halfway, but he didn't go into his little, like, rage mode. Usually that's a good time to wait out for his AoE to get some hits in. Correct. Game and discover fire, but not electricity. Alright, I'm getting a bit brave. Hey, there it is. Uh, I might not actually have enough time to run in. Oh, no. Oh, Power Within is going to kill me. Yep. Uh, if he wouldn't have retaliated... Why did he retaliate? You never know when he's going to retaliate. It's not like... It's not predictable. He does it sometimes and sometimes he doesn't. That's like the unfortunate thing to Artorius. You don't know if he's going to be a big meanie and do his little spin retaliation. I just need to get a good setup and it'll go down. It just would be nice not to have to keep running back to him. Guys, Jesus, ah, okay. I don't like y'all. Y'all literally come and block that little section. It's true, Ryan. You're right. Light attacks probably would. It's just my brain's like, but if I do heavy, he'll go down faster. <laughs> That's just my brain. It's probably not the smartest decision, but... If it gets bad, though, I'll definitely switch to light. Oh, Greg, thanks, man. Like, hey, don't, don't, like, the VOD should be up, too, or the live video should be up, so don't worry about it. I don't want you to lose too much sleep just to see it happen. The sleep is very important. Thanks, Greg. Get you next time, man. Get going.
Try this again. Okay, accidentally pressed the trigger. All right. Ah, I might. Mmm, that's a gamble. I didn't finish a dive. Nope, yep, nope. Oh. Radius on that one. Oh, RNG's is going to be on that. It's going to be this one where I'm going to have to rely on RNG a bit. I really wish they didn't make me have to run so far to him. So. Oh, all the runbacks. <laughs> I should have level ADP. Wait, why, 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 how? I went around it. My God. Ramsa. What was the point? Why? Why do you make it arbitrarily hard to get to a boss? Yeah, that's a good point, Luke. Why give the Guardian no run back? But yeah. Yeah, I kind of wish he didn't have this far of a run back. Because Calamite's well, Calamite has a deep, is it, it's not bad. I don't think it's as bad as this. Oh, it's a stupid sweep. Yeah, I'm really curious how I got lucky that first go around with uh, being able to heal and then run underneath him. No, don't make it in. Oh, oh, thank God. All oh, the runbacks. Then we're gonna power up. Yeah, that's right. The stupid dogs. I forgot about the dogs. Why, why? Why is it sometimes you're like on top of me when you do that and then like other times you're not? Why can I dodge that sometimes and sometimes I can't? Nope, I'm hit. I'm dead. Nope, we're not going to continue it? I can't roll. It's so weird. It's like depending on my the angle that I'm already at of running, I can dodge the lunge. And it's the same thing for the other one. He's like, sometimes his jump attack, he goes so much further, and then sometimes he's like, on top of me. It's so weird. I shouldn't have just, I, if I would have, oh man, I wish I would have got lucky that first round. He was so close that time. And his AI was being a lot nicer. Oh, you stupid pokes. Come on, come on. I can do it. I think the one thing that makes Artorias hard too is that he really doesn't have anything where he's like stunned super, super long. And then even if you do hit him when he's like his negative frames, he can still, like like I said, he has that chance of retaliating. So you're like, you're supposed to hit him and then like run away. Hit him and like, look, like by run away, I mean roll away. Because you, you can get hit by his like little sand attack or his uh, little circle retaliation. Oh, come on. Give me Iron Jesus. Come on.
What is it? I'm trying to figure out if I need to be already running for that to work out. Yeah, I don't... There's no way for me to get away in time after he stuns me unless I was... I guess I would have to run behind him. I'm really confused because that lunge attack would be great if I could figure it out. What position of I need to be in to dodge it, then I can abuse that. At least I have something to abuse. Or at least accurately abuse. So I need to figure that out. Just gotta deal with the bullshit of running back every time. Yeah, man. When I first fought him, his pocket sand attack caught me off guard and I died because I was laughing. Yeah. You wouldn't think he would use a, like, a dirty tactic, but he is in that like dark state. He's not the, the same knight he once was. So he plays a bit dirty. Why are you in here? You don't you don't usually leave. But alright, keep going. Oh Manfred, no, I am not allowed to roll. Uh, none at all. And only bonk. It's a pure running. His cavemen are not smart enough to roll, but they can rage. Blocking? I didn't think about trying to block his attack. That would be interesting. You didn't have to roll away, good sir. I'm gonna regret it. Wow. No. One shot. No. I knew I was gonna regret the heal. I knew it. So, apparently, from what I'm seeing, when he does his, like, little spin attack, you can actually run enough to get the distance to go back and then hit him. So, at least that's still a pretty good easy way to abuse him. Yeah, I should try to block the attack and see if it does something. Maybe the club will hold up enough to, uh, help out. But, we're slowly figuring them out. Now, when I got unlucky, he did the, his little, like, repetitive attack, which, it is to note, he will one-shot me in the, uh... Next phase. Or has a really good ch chance of one shotting me. Come on, come on. We can do it. We can be notorious. Cause it seems so far, like I did, what, it was two hits I got? Or was it two or three that I got into half health? I can't recall. I had to be close because he only has, like, what, 3,000? Is it 3,700? Maybe I got three. I don't recall. Oh, nope, that's it. Okay. Uh, I gotta heal. Hey, Taurus, hear me out. How about we leave me alone for like two seconds? I would appreciate it. Oh, no, it is his hitbox. His hitbox like gets there before he does. I literally was like stuck on his hitbox. That <laughs> was weird because it's like I was going and all of a sudden his hitbox was there and I was stopped and then he was there. And I was like, what? Yeah, it does good damage, Ryan. You're right. It's just, I need to, like, you just, this is going to be the one of those things where I just need a good start. And then just hopefully keep it going.
Oh lordy. Need to figure out. Oh no, 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 don't do it. Also, too, I need a. Uh, I don't have humanity to uh, renew my Estus flask. I probably should need more than five because I am surviving some of his hits. Ugh. Oh, Atorius. You and your barely negative frames. Which does give a good idea. Like, I should be doing roughly the same amount to Manus and Calamite. Yeah, they should be. The, I think their defenses are roughly the same. Yeah, Jagger Bird, just in time. No, don't do it. Oh. Really? I didn't want that. I didn't want his AI to do his spammy little circle slam attack. You figured out the game was intended to be played. I didn't want to add rolling, but the company forced me to. I didn't want any other weapons other than the club. Thank you for achieving my vision. <laughs> That's great. how Dark Souls was always meant to be played. No rolling club only. Might need to be a few levels into health. Yeah, unfortunately though, it's strength only, uh, Ryan. Uh, we went like hardcore with it. We said we're not going to put any points into anything else but strength. Oh, because it would be nice to put points into health. I would have done it a minute back. So that's, this, that, that's not fun. Always getting poked in my dairy air. Just keep running, just keep running. I don't know, I might need to switch it up though in the second phase, just because he's a little bit faster. I might have to go with. But it definitely seems like three bonks got him a little bit it got him a good chunk past health half. So that means it's maybe Five or six hits of heavy to kill him. So we'll have to see. Gamma, gamma, all the runbacks, all the cardio. Of course you made it. Yeah, my gamma. I can do it. I forgot power within. I'm a dummy. Oh well, we're going without it. Taurus, don't retaliate. Oh, you sucker. Help. You and your AI. <laughs> it knows, like, the perfect combo sometimes. Like, ah, uh, I know how to beat him. It's like playing the game, like, trying to play chess against the computer, and it's way too smart, and you're like, damn it. Come on. Come on, Atorius. Also, I need to use power within. That was not smart of me walking in without it.
Oh, the farmers. Kima. Kima. You stay over there. No, no. Usually they don't make it in. So weird seeing them. But all right. Round something. Nope, don't retaliate. I can't see. Oh, I got me. <sighs> Fucking camera. I might have to boost the camera speed. It's like, yeah, like I couldn't turn fast enough and I kept like, ugh. I actually have to do that sometimes for Artorias. I have to increase the camera speed so I can keep up with seeing him. If he gets out of my sight. But I'll figure it out. Come on, come on. I can do it. Oh, I'm beating my head against. Well, damn, it's getting late. Eight forty-nine. Kima. And down I go. Okay, guy. Let's try this again. Power up. And we go through. Just keep going. Yeah, he's gonna charge. Ah, I didn't make any time. Oh, it's a one shot too. Fuck. Ah, uh, shit. I was hoping not to get hit, because I was like, oh shit, I will get him by dodging it, and I just didn't get lucky that time. Man, that second phase, I think almost all of his attacks can one-shot me. Hm. I can't believe Berserk does <laughs> copied so many of my designs. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to get the slight hang of Autorius better. It's just that second phase. I just, I just want a good setup. I just keep getting a little bit unlucky. Oh, wasn't paying attention. Looking at you. Uh, do you think you do enough damage with light stop? With the light? Maybe. You mean like enough to like break his poise to stop him from transforming? I don't know. Oh, running R1. I didn't think about that. That's true. It does have a lot of long... Yeah, I probably should give it a try. I'll give it a try this round. I'll try R1 run. 
It's this one? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. I'm about it. I'm down for trying something new. I wasn't running. Oh, and I roll. I, I was still locked on. Kill me, please. Thank you. I forgot to unlock. That's on me. Also, I wasn't running. I guess that's the hard thing. If I'm turning my camera immediately, I didn't have to start the running animation to get it. But, uh, do I even have... I don't think I have any souls. If I do, I'll dark sign after. Yeah, I forgot to unlock. I knew the second I, like, I was still locked on, I'm going to immediately roll. So I guess it was, I did, the way it happened is I was going forward, right? But I let go to turn. But I would have to keep holding the run button as I turn, but I have to let go of my thumb. I have to let go of the thumb on the B button to turn the camera. So that is... So I will only probably be able to do it when I can see him properly. Not when he's like behind me. Because it caught me off guard, and I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> the dodge roll is a terrible dodge. <laughs> Why did we ever decide to put the dodge roll in? Why? No one would roll in real life. They would just run. I guess it really is a lot of the issues with that Taurus. You have to like whip around to see him. So a lot of times his negative frames, you're kind of going from the side. Unless you can roll, but that's that's a whole other story. All right. Yep. Nope. 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 I'm too scared. Oh, Jesus Christ. So, uh, hmm. Now I have mixed feelings. Because it seems like it took Hmm. Hmm. I gotta think. I gotta think about it. I wanted the entire game to be full of swamps, but they didn't want it. So I, that's right, because Miyazaki got to have his way in uh, Elden Ring with not only a poison area, then they have the, uh... Oh, uh, what's the other new blight that they put in Elden Ring? The rot. A whole area just covered in rot, which is essentially poison. Alright. Also sucks, I'm going in with four Estes every time. But, I don't think I have humanity. I don't. His one-shot game's impeccable. Also, I know for sure because I have no armor, slashing damage just does a fuck ton to me.
A Taurus, you dick. I was literally like one hit away on you. You had to poke. You couldn't just hop away. You 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 were doing good. You gave me what I wanted. And then you're like, nah, I'm gonna take it away. <sighs> so close. So close. Yeah, I think I'm probably gonna stick with the heavy. It seems the fastest way to get him killed. Yeah, the how is gonna be a. At least it's not gonna be the banging. That that was that was annoying when I the duo bosses. Ow. The ha. Oh, he fell off. Keep going, keep going. Come on. Just gotta figure it out. Really, if I can get lucky and he does that spin attack every time, I would be, like, so happy. That's, like, literally the easiest attack so far to deal with. Both rolling and this. It seems to be his biggest weak point. Oh, fuck it. Oh, you bastard. I thought I had enough time. I'm dead. Fuck. How does it not hit me sometimes? I'm so confused by its hitbox. I wonder if it's the opposite. I always kind of go around stuff to the right. Maybe I go around to his left. I guess it has to be the angle of the position. It's wild that no one used tried to use Konami's code yet. That would be funny if it... Uh, <laughs> that would be super funny. That is true, he is left-handed. I just, out of, I've always gone to his right side, but I, like, I have the fear of, like, most, like, it could be right. It could be if I go to his left side, but part of me feels like, oh, his sword's on his left, so I'm gonna get hit. But that's why I go to the right, but I still get hit. Oh, no, but wait, okay, I'm thinking of the opposite, right? Hold on. Because he's facing me, so therefore that's his left. Oh, so when I go to the right, it is going to his left, that's true. Oh, you got the happy, uh, accent mod for me. Thanks, man. Artorius? No. We weren't supposed to do a small roll. No, don't retaliate. Uh, I wasn't fast enough. I'm dead. It might not... Part of me is thinking it might not be worth going in for the AoE, because I know sometimes if you get there soon enough, he's going to want to jump away. Ugh. 
It's really gonna be if I get lucky with RNG and he does he does all the moves I need him to do. Because the second he does anything that's not like hittable, it's not gonna work. It's gonna be another RNG fight. I made a second version for those who don't use texture pack and up unpacker and just want the you died only. Oh, okay, sweet. Oh, son of a... That was too slow. Gamma. Gamma. Oh, Atorius, you're being a pain in the booty. Game on. Game on. All right, let's do it. Come on. I'm too close. Oh, lovely. I wasn't locked on. I'm dead. Artorius, why are you not cooperating? So the fastest way for you would be to download the menu version, just toss the two files into your menu file, always back up your vanilla files, of course. Bro, I was on that za when naming Elden Ring. <laughs> like what does that even mean, bro? Gamers be looking for deep meaning in these things. <laughs> that would be funny if like the entire lore was just like, there was nothing behind it actually. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm gonna have the run back more ingrained in my mind than anything. Keep running, keep running. Oh, oh. There we go. Do it. Pop it. Lock it. Drop it. All right. Oh, no, you need more than one. Oh, I was too soon. I knew it too. I started running. I was like, fuck me. I knew I went way too soon. I was trying to get there a little bit sooner so I could hit him and he would want to uh, jump back and not retaliate. At this point, we've just been going along with Vaudi's ideas. <laughs> Okay, I think in this time I might even though speeding things up hitting him in his AO uh his AOE, I might not do it. Just because it seems like it's becoming too much of a gamble whether or not I can make it in our time or not, and then whether or not he's gonna retaliate. So I guess I'll test that out this time.
No, wow, 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 more wows. All the wows. That was so stupid. All right, three Estus, that's fine. I don't need more than three, that's fine. All right. Uh, I gambled. I was curious if I ran far enough, like, forward he wouldn't be able to reach me, but that's not the case. Okay, next means next time I need to experiment with the lunge from the left side and see if, I, if that actually, if that works, that'd be great. Yeah, I know for sides, but like the past few times I've been running to the right, and then I was like, more curiosity, I was like, could I get away? And then I, my curiosity got the better of me. Because when I normally fight him, I roll to the side. I always roll to the right side. I also run off the right side when I'm reading comments. Um. Yeah, you're right, Phantom. He just wanted to go on the elevator ride. He's like, I never get to go on it. They never let me. I just wanted to go. Eh, it's not like I had any souls or humanity to worry about. I'm a broke caveman right now. In royal woods. I got a wood for you. No, I don't want your wood. Just keep running, just keep running. I am curious though if the left side would be safer. I just feel like he covers more the left side than the right, but I always get hit. Or at least I get nipped. It feels like I get nipped. Man, y'all have been doing a pretty good job of making it in here. Just gotta keep going. I pressed the wrong button. Pop it, lock it, drop it. All right. Round probably 50. Artorias, this That was not <laughs> uh... He wasn't supposed to do that That was a bad start that was there was nothing I could do about that one Just gotta keep running. Ah, do 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 do. Come on, me. Come on. I do have a feeling Cal maybe Calamite's gonna be easy. I feel like Calamite. I'm gonna get more hits off off on. Manus. Manus is gonna be the same way. I think I'm only gonna be getting one hit at a time, but. He does have a bit more opportunities for running dodge, I believe. Oh no. You normally have to roll through that thing. Ooh. 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 Think about it now for Manus with his big arm swing. Ooh. Oh, and then the lunge jump. Oh. I'm probably going to have to run away. Let him. Yeah. I shouldn't worry about that now. I got to focus on this. Yeah, Cal uh, yeah Alex, you're 100% right. You got stupid hog. Stupid, uh. Hitboxes. Did we get Artorias yet? No, we were close. I was a hit away not that long ago, but then Artorias said he's not playing fair, so. Oh, 
Ah, uh, Corius. I didn't want that. I was hoping it was going to be his other attack to run past. Oh, uh, you're watching your friend play Undertale? Oh, understandable. Understandable. Yeah, I need a... It's really, like, unfortunate, because, like, if you actually are far enough away when he does it, it's... You're not... It's not too bad to dodge it. But, like, if he's right on top of you and he does his little spin hit... I say spin hit. His slam, a uh, little, like, short slam, you're kind of just screwed. Because they definitely wanted you to roll for that attack. They did not want you to run around it. <laughs> that was an attack. They're like, no, sir, you should be rolling. Pop that thing. Pop the thing. Pop that thing. Pop all the things. All right. Let's do it. Artorias, what are you? What's your AI? Oh, I'm fucked. No, because it is in that right hand. Ugh. Why is he starting with that? He's normally pretty good about not starting with that one. Ah, uh, Artorias, why? Why are you the way you are? Why? I can't believe they let me name a <laughs> ceaseless discharge. <laughs> they like. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. That's crazy. That is legit, I think, one HP right there. That has to be actual one HP. Like you could, you could barely, see, I could barely see the red line. Come on, see. Hatorius. Play nice. Okay, Taurus, I need you not to be a butt and keep doing the most horrible move that I can't dodge. What is going on? He's never done it this many times. Like, ha. Ah. The RNG right now is just... I was already being fucked in the ass, but now they're really fucking me in the ass. Yeah. No, because there's no way to really dodge it. Because if he hears that close, you can't run away from it. You're already near the edge of the wall. So no, I don't think you even can... I don't think there is any way to get around it. No. no, I just have to get lucky with the start. His AI is just being stupid. Of shit. Bada bing, bada boom. Ah. 
You're gonna charge, aren't you? Nope, you're gonna retaliate. Man, come on. You normally, after I hit you twice, you back off and you're like, I'm gonna rage. Like you're doing now, after you retaliated. He really doesn't know. Uh, you're completely right, Phantom. He does not like cavemen at all. Onga bonga to hello. Hey, Akios. I just need him to repeat, like, that one move, like, six times, and we're golden. Just sp let him spin, and then I can hit him. But he doesn't want to keep spinning. Yeah, oh, the farmers, they're so, like, I roll past them normally. I can't roll past them. Oh. Oh, no rolling. Not today. All right, come on. Come on. Why do you re Why do you retaliate sometimes and you sometimes don't notorious? Why? Why can't you? Why are you unpredictable? That's still a long way to the bosses again. Wish someone could make a mod that adds some bonfires near the bosses. Yeah, like I understand that. Honestly, I could like technically you can use save states so that if let's say you die, you just redo the save state right near the beginning of the fight. Because all you would have to do is exit the game, you would have a save file, and then you could just reload back in. Which I could do that technically, but at the moment I haven't felt like the need to do it. But it might be better for future uh <clears throat> Future things for me to actually have it set up to hotkey. Because I don't have uh, my save states up set up to like hotkey. I just have it where I manually save it. And I would have to have it all prepped up so I could just like press like F something to save it and then restart it. But it's probably for certain like harder stuff. I probably should have save states. Because I do use them from time to time when it gets really, really bad. Just so I don't have to keep running back and forth. At some points, it's like you just want to fight the boss, right? Not running back to the boss. And doesn't let me go around him. Ain't free. It really bothers me, his hitbox literally just blocks you. You could literally go around him, but his foot, like, catches you. So you, you literally run in a single spot and it stops you. Instead of just allowing you to glide past him. Very, very silly. But he, like, it would, I think it would be almost... Oh, well, I guess they didn't want that, but it's still, like, a horrible way of going about it. Or maybe I have to do, like, wide circles around him. I don't know. I don't know. But right now he's he's not being as generous with his uh AI or or his pathing as before. He's being a bit of a dick. He's not giving me anything to work with.
Oh, that's so stupid. One hit. Oh, I don't know why I thought I was going to go faster, but I didn't. I went a lot slower than I thought. But that really does piss me off that his leg is like all of a sudden there and you can't go around it. Ugh. <clears throat> I wonder, I'm trying to remember. Did I roll underneath him though? Or maybe, okay, I need to remember. I had a strategy when I was doing the skull run. And I'm trying to vaguely remember. But I can't remember if I rolled it to do avo like to avoid that attack, or you have to look at him as you're running underneath him. For some reason, like I like I remember when I looked up to run underneath him, it worked. And I don't know why. But it could have been I rolled too, I don't remember. So I have to figure that out, whether or not which I could do it next time. I just need him to be generous in his what he chooses to do at the beginning. Also, I need to be faster in reaction of getting close to him to hit him so he wants to not retaliate. It seems like the longer you wait, the more likely he's just going to retaliate and not, uh... And not hop away. <laughs> Alright, come on. Stupid. Oh, lovely, Artorius. Can't do nothing. Oh, why, dude? Why? Why are you just being such a butt with your, uh, pa like, your AI pattern right now? You're literally, like, you went for the longest time not doing it. Now you're like, ah, oh, I must... Spam it now. I must spam my little spin attack. Spin and boom, spin and boom. Oh yeah, Havel's flip? Yeah. I'm pretty sure you can get the equipment load to 25%. Now, I'm pretty sure you probably have to have Havel's ring... Probably maxed out stamina. I can't remember. There's a certain part where stamina doesn't really give you anything, even in your equipment load. I can't remember. Come on, Notorious AI. Work with me. Work with me. I controlled a lot C and V Ornstein and gave him some flips. <laughs> so I've been going to the side for a good bit for the lunge attack. Like I tried to for like all of them going. Like, do you mean like even like the the, the put yeah the lunge like the where the thrust? Because I've been going to the side and he still nips me. Like or at least I feel like I'm going to the side. Or maybe I'm not going enough to the side. Oh, shit. Wasn't paying attention. Oh, well. No, I am going diagonal. Yeah. Oh, the one time I wasn't like, like pre-running. Well, either way, I barely had any damage on. Yeah, it seems like when I am going to it, I'm like going diagonal and not pure sideways. So I need a, that's a good call, Ryan. I need to think about it when I go at it, not diagonal to the side, but like pure hardcore, like right turn. That's a good call.
I guess it's a, it's a muscle memory thing I'm thinking of now of like when I roll, that's how I roll. I go to that angle and then I'll roll to dodge it and then hit him. So I think it's like my muscle memory thinks like, oh yeah, you are to the side, but it's not like a full legit run sideways. No, you're right, Ryan. It is not caveman friendly. Not at all. Also, I need to make sure you use power within this time so I can do some big damage. Big, big damage. Oh, it did it again! Like, what the hell? Why? Why? That, that's that's frustrating. Like, why? Like, I was just running underneath him, and the like the AI path thing's like, ah, oh, we're gonna be an ass. We're gonna put him right there in front of you. Like, come on. Like, that's just ah, uh, that's annoying. That's extremely annoying. I definitely felt like I had it that time. I was like, oh, perfect. I'll just run right underneath and I won't get hit because I've already pre run before it and it'll be fine. It's. Uh... Oh. That's uh, too. I can figure it out. I guess the one part that's rough about it is that that second phase, I think every single one of his attacks just one-shots me. So it's like I pretty much just can't get hit. Which sucks. Oh, that's true. I could level a bit. I am not at my cap. I am definitely below my cap. Which I guess if I was at higher level, I would probably have some more defense for resistance, but... I didn't make it time, but you're right, Ryan. I pulled it off. At least that, that one, I saw it. I hurried up and did a super hard right, and I was able to dodge it. So that's a good note from it. Even though the beginning was bullshit, but at least we know I need to have that mental, uh, like, or that reminder of knowing, like, okay, I see it, just hard, hard, hard. <clears throat> now I just need him not to be a butt and not keep doing the same stupid move that I can't dodge. Ow. You know, you're not wrong. Well, I'm also tired, Phantom Eve. That's probably a, a, like a combination from like a, yesterday streaming for 11, almost 12 hours. If you think about it, 11 hours and 40 minutes. And then, you know, working today and doing other stuff and then doing this now. It's probably just compiling and where I'm weaning. Now. But part of me wants to be like, you know what, I'll, I'll probably kill a Taurus and I'll call it and we'll continue it from tomorrow just so I can get a good night's sleep. Yeah, if you go look, look at it, it was 11 hours and 40 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> I really wanted to try to do it in one go. I was That was my goal. I really wanted to see if I could do it in one push. But I just couldn't do it after a while. 
Because like, so my mindset was like, the faster I get it done, the faster I get to work on the video. And that's my usual mindset when I go at it. Yeah, that was my first stream too. Yeah, yeah. Because like, when I did the last video, I I I played the game for ten hours when I was doing the skull run. So I knew I could uh yeah just kill me, Artorias. Oh, lock on system. You betrayed me. A door is dope. Oh, I actually dodged it. Look at that. Oh, I'm out. Oh, lovely. I kind of want to die. I'm out of Estus. It, it looks like if I get, I don't get stuck on his leg, it works. Oh, I appreciate it, Family Eve. I understand. No, you're not wrong, Jagabird. I should, but I have no humanity. I would have to go farm rats. Yep, I would have to go farm. Part of me is just being hard-headed and not wanting the farm. Dude, you're such a legend for holding on this long to get all... Get all the sleep you need. Yeah, I know. I know. After after Artorias. After Artorias. I will, I will get the sleep. Or, I guess if it gets to a point where I have to call it quits. But, we'll, we'll see it. Stubborn as an Irish man, a blessing and a curse, believe me. <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure funny enough. I think on my dad's side, we have a good bit of Irish, so... Who knows, maybe it's the genetics. Why did you retaliate? Why did it put me in front of your face? Oh, I, I thought you were going to run away. Why are you being a turd? Artorius! I thought you were going to jump away and do that. Why did you retaliate, you fucker? I, ha I did good dodging that time, too. I was so proud. I was like, oh, hell yeah, look at that. I'm kind of figuring him out. Look at it. And then Artaurus is like, no, I'm gonna fuck it all up. Stupid Artaurus. Yeah, I'm noticing now for when he does his big jump, if I don't just run straight, but I kind of like run around, it seems like I'm being successful. And for sure, Ryan was 100% right. I wasn't going enough to the side. So that works out really well. It's been consistent so far of just going pure hard right, dodging the attack. So where the pieces are falling into place, just like Ornstein and Smo. It's just sometimes it takes a long time to figure it out. Miyazaki, thoughts on the bed of chaos? <laughs> Now we're asking the really hard questions. The last run is far too short. <laughs> I wanted it to be double the last, but they told me no.
Majora's, you're in the mood. Ah, oh, I wasn't up fast enough. Wait, I need a heal. Oh, why? Majora's, you suck. You suck. Why are you? Ugh, you're so inconsistent. <laughs> Also, I can run- I can dodge it by running. If I loop hard enough, like, up and around, you can dodge it by running. It's just hard. <laughs> it's just really hard. Taurus, can we have like a good start, please? Not a bullshit start. Oh, I didn't go up and around enough, so I got stuck on his hitbox. Oh, no, wasn't fast enough. Oh, well. I'm dead. Damn, I thought it was, I got nipped again, but I thought I went. Did I not go hard enough, right? Hmm. Maybe I wasn't running long enough, so I didn't get enough distance, and I didn't turn soon enough. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Why are some old games so good and nostalgic, like Dark Chronicles, for example? The music from the older games were really good. Uh, it could be the fact that. If, if you really look at it back in the day, video games were a bit more very niche -ish, niche. So, like, the business side of things wasn't as harsh on them. Like, when I mean business, like, super corporate, where, like, the devs, the devs most days don't really have a decision. The business side has more power over the devs. So, like, perfect example, like, Dragon's Dogma with their microtransactions. I promise you the devs of Dragon's Dogma didn't want to do that, all that. They probably wanted to do better. But I can imagine Capcom's business side was like, no, 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 no. We are going to have transactions and you're going to put it in. Because I like I do software engineering and the business, like even if we tell the business side, we like, oh, no, we should do this. They're like, nope, we're gonna, you're going to do what we, what we want to do, whether it's shady or not. I'm like, OK. It's just unfortunately, video games has become so popular that big corporations have taken over and they just do this the basic like we want to make a lot of money we don't care about making a good product that's why a lot of indie games are really good is because it's passionate devs who care about the game like hollow knight is a fantastic game which is funny when you see indie games sell better than triple a games but it's usually due to the uh business side Devs don't really have too much say in that. Wow. Okay. No, I wasn't running soon enough, so I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna die?
And sad truth place to like from stuff and some well known independent companies as are usually the better ones for not doing it. Yeah. They still Yeah. No exactly. True, it's all about making money with games, not gamers once true. Yeah, that's unfortunate, but that's why like I really like indie games. Most of the time, they just, you could tell a lot of times the devs put a lot of time and care into it. And I think that's where, if companies were smart, they would let their devs do things the right way. Should we add microtransaction to the soul scene? <laughs> that would, oh my god, that would destroy, that, that would, that would start a riot. I could just see it. Nope, I'm not paying attention. I was trying to read. The only way to make a good game these days would be to make it all alone or in a group. Uh, say we have to do. That's why some companies... Yeah, with Kickstarter, yeah. No, you're true. Uh, Accus. Unfortunately, that's just how it goes for to get decent games. Phantom Eve, $2. Cheers from your sanity, the entertainment game. <laughs> Thank you, Phantom Eve. I really, really appreciate it. Tie night chunks at dollar ninety nine cents. <laughs> oh Lord! Oh, uh, thank you again, Phantom Eve. I really appreciate it. Gotta do it now. Gotta do it for it. Notorious, you're a dick. Oh god, why? Your AI, your AI is horrible. You've been on a horrible run. It's like all my luck with him was in like the first 20 tries. I did so well and then now it's all out the books. His AI doesn't want to uh, keep repeating. He wants to do that one move that's really hard to dodge. And he's wanting to retaliate a lot more than normal in the first phase. Oh, I didn't think about it. I could send that elevator back up. That's true. I didn't think about that, Accius. Hmm. Need to think. Actually, I can't. That's not really about thinking at this point. It's about hopefully he gives me the proper setup and I execute properly, I guess. I don't know. It's. This is where I'm having trust issues when I'm doing some of it, where it's like, it feels a bit wonky, where it's like, man, this worked a while ago, but why is it not working now? Like, what did I do that worked here and doesn't work here? Trust me, once you had to use the elevator in DS3 to get to the boss again around 20 times, you'll never forget it ever again. Oh, that's true. That's a very good call. Because then I don't have to deal with the waiting and then dealing with the damn, uh, farmers. That's very true. Come on. Notorious. Oh, do it again. Oh, I made the horrible decision to run to the left. I didn't actually I couldn't run really run to the right. There wasn't nothing to the right. But fact, you cannot run to his left. He will fuck you up. Which again makes sense. The 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 weapon is on that side. Now so far I really does see the spinning one is the easiest to be consistent when hitting him, but which, I, during the Skull Lantern run, I try to make him do that one the most, too, but right now, it doesn't seem like he wants to do it. He really wants to spam his damn spin one. I, like, I don't know why earlier he didn't want to do it, and now he's all about it.
You know what the terrifying thing is? If the chance that the encoding is still wrong, I'm going to have to do this all over again, even if I do beat him. Because I'll need the footage. That's going to be sad. Yeah, man. Stupid hitbox. Yeah, of course, Artorius. No! I thought I was gonna get my SS off in time. Why did your one attack have to put me like 10 percent like 5 percent? I know I shouldn't go for him in that position, but I just like I know it puts me like two hits away. I'm just like, ugh. Ugh. Some Ghibli guy stole my name. <laughs> like get your own name. <laughs> uh I beat the whole Sekiro boss for us in the time you've been doing this. <laughs> I, I like as you phrase it as a god, whereas I'm just feel like I just feel like a guy who's like literally, you know how they have the door where it, like it says to pull, but you keep pushing or the op either way, you're doing the opposite of what the door says. That's how I feel right now, <laughs> but I appreciate it. I really do. Oh, my left ear. $40 DLC. Oh, crazy. <laughs> I believe in you, bro. You made it further than I ever could. Oh, you could do it, too. Like I said, you you just have to beat your head against the wall. <laughs> it's, 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 but it, the question is, is it worth beating your head against the wall? <laughs> That's the real question. Cause like I said, it's a, the odds game, right? Like it's gonna eventually I might get, I'll get lucky. I just gotta keep doing it. How far away are you? Oh, you're all over there. Lovely. No, I rolled. I locked on accidentally. Oh, I was gonna get hit either way. Oh well. I forgot. I like I like accidentally moved my hand over and locked on for some reason. I was like, oh fuck. Oh well, it happens. It is what it is. Damn it. Yeah, man. Don't poke me. Okay, fine. Part of me would like to t potentially risk using the Elizabeth mushrooms, but I don't know if it's worth it. Because I still think if he one-shots me, he one-shots me. It does it like Elizabeth mushrooms don't matter at that point because they can only recover if you haven't been one-shotted. Oh, lordy.
Yeah, that's what I thought too, Ryan. Yeah, not a feeling. You had to do it that way, Artorius. You had to do your small roll and not your big, like, I'm gonna go, no. Oh, oh, oh. I hate it when he does that. That happens sometimes. He'll literally roll into you, so then he doesn't get away. And then he's right next to you, so he's gonna attack immediately. That happened quite a bit on my other runs, so. It's like, why, why did you roll right on top of me? Why? Just keep running. You're a turd. Come on. Come on. I bet, too, if I wasn't just using the club and I was using the great club or the large club, I bet the amount of damage I would have been doing would be insane. It's that slight regret of only using the beginning glove. Club? Club? A glove. Glove. A glove. Alright, I have to go sadly. Have fun, chat. See you, Alex. Appreciate it that you made it out, man. I don't know why I'm like, my, I don't know why I'm, I had the reaction time to want to click it, because I wasted time clicking instead of running away. And I'm pretty sure if I wouldn't have had to click and unclick, ugh, I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I'm doing that when I'm right in front of them. Like, I know I should be, I guess I'm scared I'm not going to hit him, so my body's like, ah, oh, lock on. Do not lock on when he's right in front of you. You're 100%. By the way, little fun fact in DS2, you cannot run if you were on zero stamina until the stamina. Oh. Oh. Letting go of your fears is hard, especially in this kind of run, but you can do it. With I thank you, Phantom Eve. I know, I need to. I need to, I need to just know not to do it yet. That is true. I probably should go buy the charcoal pine resin um, from the female merchant. Actually, are he... Do you sell charcoal pine resin? That probably would be good to try to speed up the damage output. Yes? I, I forgot his conversation, what it does. What do you sell? You do not, unfortunately. Okay. So long. And say Unga Bunga. You got a point, J uh, Jagged Bird. You got a point. Just got a bunga.
That's unfortunate. He was one hit away. I was really hoping he wasn't going to do that move too. Because I was like, it's so inconsistent for me not to get hit. Yeah, his his slam attack is bad. Like, his hitbox is bad. It hits you even though you're not next to it. It's like... I freeze-framed in Premiere Pro. Like, the hitbox is a legit, legitimate circle probably around him. Even though it shouldn't be. It's like, it's, it's, it's a pretty big circle around him. Like, it, like, whatever his front area is, it's also slightly into his back. Oh, you think it was two hits away? Uh, I thought maybe it was maybe one. You could be right. He might, it might not have been enough. I would have to do the math. I know I've been seeing 660 something, but remember what you've been taught big, oh wait, the little heart thing always covers up one of the words, big damage. So boink. Yep. True. True. He could be the brother of, let's so Oh God. I don't know how to pronounce that word. From Monster Hunter with that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, I think I know the one you're talking about. Yeah, no. The hitbox on Notorious and the DLC bosses. Some of them are pretty wonky. Okay, lock-on system, you just fucked me over. That's fine. Why? You bastard of a lock-on fucking system. Nah, I'm not in time. I, I didn't run that. That's the one thing I, I despise about freaking the lock-on system, instead of locking on, it will sometimes just rotate your camera just backwards. It's like, why? Why is that a, why is that a concept? Like, why? Like, ugh. Why? Why, camera, why? Is it because, I know for sure, it's probably because I pressed the lock-on system too soon, and I should have hurried up and... I should have turned, then locked on, instead of lock on while I was trying to turn. The charcoal pine resin should definitely make you need less want that is true. But my issue uh, I would have to stock up on a lot of charcoal to make sure I have enough, depending on how many times I get just janked. But you're not wrong, Ryan. You're not wrong. I'll go one more time and then after that I'll make my way to the female merchant and buy some. I still, unfortunately, I still fall into the issue of um, if I just get unlucky. That's gonna suck using the the charcoal. Unless I save the charcoal, I that's what I probably should do. Save the charcoal for when I get into the second phase, just so so maybe slightly more guaranteed. I don't know. Where are you at? I'd get so confused. I knew I should have went around. My brain was just like, you need to roll around, but my body didn't react. Ugh. Do I even have enough souls to... Oh, I have a... Ugh. I might not have enough souls to actually buy. How much does that even give me? Uh, I actually would have to go farming for souls. Oh. Oh. Oh, bye, Miyazaki. Hmm.
All right, come on. Don't retaliate, you fucker. Why? Why do you have to retaliate? Why? What's the next run idea? Maybe a randomizer and you have to use the first first weapon that you find and before you start to choose the class you have to say a number and pick the class without knowing. Oh, yeah, we can add that down, but I usually do polls to let, like, um, you know, to let everyone decide, so whatever majority goes. But, yeah, we can write that one down and add it in. But, because after I do this, I, like, after I finish streaming, or actually, uh, like, officially beat this run, we'll, uh, I'll make a poll out for everyone, for the list that I have, and y'all get to decide. That's how, actually, that's how this run got started, was, uh, was through a poll. Oh, thorn, ar ar uh, thorn armor only? Yeah, I've seen a uh, little Aggie do that. Uh, he's done that one before. Which I'm not opposed to not doing it. Alright, come on. It really just feels like you have to almost get lucky with them in the second phase. Because if he retaliates on me, you know, like, any time I go to attack him and he doesn't roll away, I'm just screwed. Oh, the wall. Motherfucker. Atorius, why did you do- like, how? Uh, I didn't expect him to chase me that long. Normally he does something by then. He doesn't usually chase me to the end of the thing. Now I'm trying not to fuck with my camera because your camera decides, like, sometimes the angle that you're gonna be at when you run. Or it's harder if your camera is changing when you're looking to hit that angle. <sighs> Oh, thank you, Phantom Eve. I appreciate it. A Torres Blade of Millennia. That is very accurate right now. Bunk, bunk. Part of me like almost wants to get greedy sometimes and try to do two hits to see if I can pull it off. So I was like, man, if I can get the second hit off, the amount of damage, that would be so nice. I don't know if it'll be worth it. Fat roll only run? That would be kind of fun. That'd be funny. What? Couldn't I then abuse it and just do the running method? <laughs> In the worst case. <laughs> or you have to fat roll everywhere. That's kind of funny. That would take forever. I think that, that would be f slower than the... Uh, if you're fully encumbered. No running around. <laughs> I 
And there's his little cheap attack. Nope, I'm not hitting you this time. Ah, oh, fuck. I wasn't able to get around. Yeah, I really need... Okay, lesson learned. I'm not do. I'm not gonna... Yeah. It seems like the only way to really make that efficiently work is with the roll. It's just not efficient with the run. He's too inconsistent if he's not gonna... It seems like he's more likely to retaliate if you hit him and you're just hanging out by him. So from now on, it'll have to be near him to get the chip damage at the beginning. No problem, I got a categorized list with the Soulsborne games and ID on it. That fan suggested. Oh damn, appreciate it, fan. I think also I need to I need to make sure I need to ugh, I need to go back and find my list. I, mean, I know I've been having people comment different stuff, so I need to go back and relook through and uh, make sure I have it all marked down. Yeah, the hitbox is very, very, very janky for uh, Ornstein in some cases. I have it already. Oh yeah, summon it back up. Actually, I think at this point, this might be taking longer than uh, Ornstein and Smell. It's just that one-shotness when he's in that second powered-up state. It's like, ugh. Actually, that means Mana's fight's probably going to be longer. He has 6,000 HP. I gambled. I was saying maybe he won't retaliate. But he retaliated. Cause he's a butt. A stinky, stinky butt. How about a pacifist run? You're not allowed to attack anything until they attack you first. Oh, so you basically have to get hit. You can only hit them if they hit you. So basically you have to get take one damage to start the boss fight. That's a good call. I probably should try that out, Luke, with the uh, blocking with the... Uh, I should try to think about that. But my brain thinks to run away. Uh, not the I should but you can run and block so that's a good call unless if my back is facing him then it won't matter Yeah I don't know why I'm doing all over here, but whatever You know what? I, I wanted to know. I wanted to know if I could pull it off. I was really curious if he would just do one of the things where he kind of hangs out for a second and I can get the second hit. I was really curious. So I went for it. One HP, one stamina run? Oh. Oh, damn. So I guess with that one stamina, you would get one roll. Actually, would it make rolls more efficient? Because then it would recover fast. You just can't run, though. Because you obviously it would be an instantly out. But you only need a you only need one stamina right to roll, correct? So it's just one HP, one stamina is just basically a no hit run, just a little bit harder essentially because you can't get hit. So you basically have to one shot all the bosses. Blocking should save you from a one shot. Okay, I'll I'll, make, I'll try to make sure I remember to do it. I thought I put this thing back up here. One HP, one stamina, and we start 
at the front of the bed. <laughs> oh, the bed of chaos. Oh no! Oh no! I didn't think about the bed of chaos. No, oh, but well, no, because all you would have to do for bed of chaos is do the uh, firebomb. Skip. That's true. DS1 does not use uh, stamina for magic. Or have a magic meter, in general. Ah, turd. No, oh, he's too close to the wall. Come on. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Got him out of there. I was hoping he would jump. Um, I was just trying to speed it up. Because I knew even if I ran away to heal, it wasn't going to really... Um... It feels so inconsistent. Like, I feel like I am running... I feel like I am doing better running sideways. But that does feel... I think it's like you have to be... Like, I have to already be running. If I do the... Because the startup animation takes forever for the run. It's like a whole half sec... Like, like I hold it for like a half a second. And then it's like, okay, now I run. It's not instant. If it was a bit more instant, I think it would have been a bit more smooth. Uh, would a magic only run with no intelligence mine upgrade be possible? Oh, so starting with the base stat of the, uh, the sorcerer. Huh, that would be interesting. It probably could be. You probably have to put a lot of points into attunement, so you just could have a lot of spells. So you, because you can buy multiple spells. You probably just have to have a good stock, I would probably say. Because then you have power within. Yeah, I think you could be done. Yep, I think it could be done. When he runs at you, then you might be able to block. Oh, the lance? Oh, you don't, you don't think it's going to break? Like, break my poise? I can give it a shot. I'm willing to test it. Uh, I can't use the fist, though. Then I'm not using the club. Oh, once you have... Oh, we're going on to the other thing. Okay. Wrong, wrong thing. Oh, of course you... Oh, that was beautiful. Oh. Uh, I input. This is just for... That, this was weird. Okay. You gotta do a third one? Yeah, good boy. Thanks, guys. My list has now doubled. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, Phantom Eve. Uh, did I tell you about the one where someone said that like, I had to start off being cursed and I, ha I can only use the broken sword the entire time? So I'm pretty sure that was all that it gave to me. I'd have to double check the comment. I really do need to... I need to do that. I'll add it to my list and make a Discord uh, so we can communicate a lot better, uh, Phantom Eve. And all of us as a group as a general. I need to get around to that to make a proper one. Uh, for one, it can't be worse than the Skull Lantern. Y'all don't understand. Like, the fact that I do damage, I'm just like, this is nice. Now, granted, I don't have health. That was like the saving grace of the Skull Lantern run is just all the HP. It allowed me to have be abused and used. That's true, Jagged Bird, that's true.
Taurus, you have Ischios. I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna go for it. Okay. Why are you? Ooh, okay. Oh, thought I could make it. I gambled. I gambled. Yeah, I should. I need to make time for it. I'll add it down. Obviously, with making the video, I'll probably. I'll try to mix it in. I'll probably be more when I'm closer to finish editing the video to take because I know it's probably going to take me a minute to figure out how to make a proper Discord. I've never done it, so I'm going to have to watch a lot of videos. I can imagine it take a minute. Oh, thank you, Ryan. Yeah, it was, it was tedious. It, it's I don't know. This one's coming on par with the tediousness, but at least those two bosses. Oh, pokey, 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 pokey. Yeah, I need to figure out, because I know there's a lot of stuff I need to do to make sure it's like a proper Discord with good rules and other stuff said and all that other jazz, especially. Oh, I got you, Phantom Eve, yeah. Oh, you think, like, try to DPS him down as fast as possible? Can you stop him from going into the second phase? Oh, well, obviously, if you kill him before he goes into the second phase. It can hit him three instead of two times. Oh, maybe. Oh, you think, like, if I just try to DPS him as he's going into the second phase? Can you actually break him out of his second phase? Like, can you break his poise? Because that would be interesting if you could break him. I don't know if I'm doing enough damage to break a poise, but I could be wrong. You can knock him out of it? I didn't know that. Well, Taurus, I can't do nothing when you do that move. Honestly, I thought you were going to uh, lunge at me. For Claymore, uh, two hits? Oh. You can prevent... Okay, that's a good plan now. Let's try to do that then. Because if I would have... Uh... Because I know for sure when he is powering up, though, he it takes it, it's a uh, he takes he takes less damage for sure. But I can give it a shot. If that works, that'd be great. Because then we could just DPS him like as soon as possible. Or maybe even potentially, if he stun breaks him too, you get another hit, which would be great. Can y'all not? Yeah, Claymore is a good weapon. I used it for a good bit in, uh, I think it was my second run when I did a, a miracle build. I had it just in case, but I mostly was throwing lightning bolts on my second run. Spam R1? Yeah, that makes sense. I'll give it a shot. I'm, I'm willing to experiment. Yeah, you're right. One good. It's true. If I can get the stun off, it probably he would be done. Yep, I knew it. Animation. Yep. No, I was hoping he wasn't gonna go for his. A flippy flip, but he did his flippy flip. He did his flippy flip because 
Apparently, all he knows is flipping. Come on. We need the you can walk away while using Estes mod. <laughs> the let me drink it faster, please. I would, I'll be honest with you, if there was a stat point to like allow me to drink the Estes faster, I would do it. I would do it in a heartbeat. Well, obviously, I can't do it here because I'm doing strength only, but in general, in most runs, I would do it. Just, I don't know how many times I've had to deal with it where it's like that you drink your Estes just a hair too long. Especially in the uh, Taurus fight, it's like your your drinking time was not meant for that speed of a fight. Really? Well, at least it allows you to use it faster, so at least there's a level for it. <laughs> ADP flashbacks. <laughs> And off we go to the races. Interesting. Ah, uh, wasn't fast enough. Ah, uh, nope. Wasn't able to get it. Uh, but the unfortunate thing is I wasn't as close. So. I wonder if I should have... It would have been the smarter move to do heavy, maybe... What's the animation time? No, okay, it's, it's pretty slow. I wonder if a double heavy would do it. And if I was a lot closer. I got unlucky in that time. He was a uh, he was a good little distance from me. If that would help getting the uh, the blossoms yep we hit the two hour it's probably the same as a uh, orange stain smell the damage isn't bad it's just getting the hits in and not getting unlucky with this damn uh Don't you dare retaliate. Why? Why are you so inconsistent? That's not fair. Well, actually, it's fair because you're supposed to roll, so that's on me. But... <clears throat> Maybe if he dies on age. So, fun fact, I didn't mention it in my Skull Lantern run, but the fight went so long, he's powered up... I think his powered up state ran out. Is he or he wouldn't do his AOE anymore? I don't think it ran out. He literally the fight went so long he stopped doing his AOE, and I got so upset towards the end because I was like, "Oh, I can't use this to hit him anymore." Because he won't do it. <laughs> I think for like the last 15 minutes he just wouldn't do it. Of you know, the fight or like his last maybe 25% of health he wouldn't do it anymore. I can even get lucky this time where he wants to do it right in front of me and not run away. Game ran out of memory storage for it. I understand, Luke, but that's more of a 
my quality of when I put the video out, like I want it to be in uh, 1440p. So, but like if I come back and try it on my own accord, I might actually go get like the fi like go get the pine resin and stuff. Like I might actually do it. It kind of just depends on like when I'm going solo at it. No, you're not. Okay. I was definitely far enough. That's cheap. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, I wasn't running. Fuck, I'm dead. But I pulled off the block, though. I pulled off my first block. It still looks good. Yeah, it's more, um... Fan of me, the recording. So, what happened, like, yesterday was the fact that the recording wasn't, like, it wasn't set up properly. So, so much of what's, like, it can mess with the actual recording footage. Because you have the stream, right? But then you have to record. But the record footage came out laggy. Like, the, there was frame skips. Like, it would skip stuff and be, like, very off-putting. Like, every five seconds, you would be seeing skips. Actually, it was maybe even less. Um, and it's just, it became unusable uh, for that. Like, when I was looking at it, it's like I couldn't, sh like, even when you're watching Ornstein die, it was, like, jagged. I was like, no, I can't do that. It's not good quality. Which is, again, it's on me not taking the proper time to make sure I had everything set properly and testing things properly. I kind of winged it when I shouldn't have. So that's that's on me. You also removed his second face? Really? I didn't realize that's what happened. We can just use the console command and give ourselves a ring and no puppy death. Oh, I know. Oh, I'm not either, Phantom Eve. Yeah, it's just it's just what happened. Like I tried testing it a bit today and it still like had some funk, but I I, I adjusted it before the stream. It's like the amount of bits that could be given, and I think the recording for it to be it needs a bit more than the streaming. And some other stuff, so I just got the balancing act. Now I'm gonna miss. I survived? I'm dead. Yep. Uh, I thought I was going to get to him in time. We do the anime run where you have to say what you do before you do it. For example, if you want to do the jump attack, you have to just say jump attack. Oh, is it like uh, with Luffy when he goes, uh, was it? No. Oh, God. It's been so long since I've watched uh, One Piece. Where it's like Nomono uh, something. Yeah, something along that line. Or with Naruto, and then we say Rasengan. Or Shadow, Gun, uh, Shadow Clone no Jutsu. Resin costs 500 souls. One grind for the Forest Hunters area would get you 8 to 10 resins. That's true. That's true. I'll do it after this one. I'll, I'll put my pride aside. Going but for behind him? I feel... I could try that. I could try trying to go for behind. But it's like you almost have to loop him because you get stuck on his hitbox. Which is very annoying. Like his hit, like you'll try to run around him. That's the one thing. Yeah, it might be hard to see. I can like I can feel it when I like I'm like playing it. Is that I hit his like his leg hitbox and it stops me. Like it literally stops me from going around him and it slows me down. And that's where he usually gets me. It's because I didn't make it around that hitbox. Man, 
Imagine a pirate game with Souls combat. That would be interesting. That sucks. Yeah, it wasn't fucked up. <sighs> All right, I'll go grind for the resin. I'll give me up. I'll give me if I don't beat him by midnight. I'll call it. Oh, the toxic ocean, my god. When's midnight for me? About an hour and a half. It's 10.35 my time. Or 10.35 p.m., I should say. So we said there are 500 a pop. Okay, so two of them each can be about 400. You would really think in the DLC area, they'll give you a bit more. But I guess I'm gonna have to kill those big boys to get a lot. AM? Oh, damn. That wasn't a one-shot? He could have been a one-shot. Also, oh no, I bought the one humanity from her. I might be able to get enough souls to, to... Oh no, I'm dead. They also had the fun time in this area, control CV. 936 for you, bud. That's what, that's uh, math, that's central time. I mean, the uh, Covenant Forest level making them. Oh, that's true. You can go and do the that. Um, that's true. I should go get the souls I have though. Oh, YouTube, Luke, you're on Eastern. Uh, that was good. Okay, there we go. Okay, I know the souls are somewhere over here. Do I still have? I don't have it set there. That's fine. All right, I'll go do the forest hunters real quick. Stock up, go buy, buy some pine resin, and we'll come back. My rest is around 4 to 5 a.m. until 11 or 12. Damn. 3 a.m. Damn, Dragon Bird. Damn. Gotta wake up at 7 during the week. Oof. Oh, uh, why you? You normally don't hit me. Why are you being this way? Also, I might need to, like, farm some extra souls so I can buy humanity from, uh, what's his name? From the DLC area and, uh... 
Try to give myself some more Estus. Come on, come on. Yeah, I know. Okay. All right, let's set it. Took three hours to do something and you're still playing. Holy shit. <laughs> Keep up the grind. <laughs> Thanks, Punk Geeks. Yeah, I'm being a bit hard-headed. I said I, I want to beat Artorias before I go to bed. I'm just- that's just how I am sometimes. Like, I just- it's, it's hard for me to call it quits. Yeah, at this point it is, you're right. I'm stuck on the tree! Yeah, hey, one shot. Not one shot. When you're so powerful, you don't need to do the skip. I'll go for the extra guys, so it gives an extra thousand. Okay. He's got a heck of a Yeah, to a degree, yeah. Yeah. I it's I get kinda like lasered into something and I like if I wanna get it done, I'll I'll keep going. I kinda just Always been that way. Oh no, you did that? That is nuts. Nope, I don't like it. But I still win. Dead. I was gambling. I knew I was going to trade. Dead. Unfortunately, I think the humanity that he sells is like 10k. So maybe it's not worth going for the grind. I'll do uh, like a run or two more just to make sure I could buy a good chunk of the uh, pine resins because I just feel like I'm going to die a lot. Oh, you heat seeking bullshit. Have I beaten? Oh no, I have not beaten Autorus yet. I'm still on Autorus. I've been on Autorus for about two hours, a little over two hours now. Oh wait, hold on. Did I kill the invisible dude? No, I did not. Now we're gonna play this game. I had a feeling I needed to try the regular swing on that time. What y'all been doing? Bailing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was doing good against them, but it's, uh... There was a, like, if you... 
It, unfortunately, so you know like how Taurus has that attack where he jumps and spins and like he can hit you like three times in a row? If he does that, it's really, really, really hard to dodge. And he went from not really doing it to doing it a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Because you, uh, you, like I got close. There was one time I was the one hit. I was a couple of times from one hit away, I think. But I just got unlucky and then he got me. But we did find out a lot of new things about it. Blocking does a good, uh, good, like, protects me. It doesn't break my poise. So it's a good, actually might be a good option when he lunges at me to not try to run away. Just block, hit him, and just take the damage. Just tank it. Alright, I'll do one more run, and then we go buy the resin. We also found out a Taurus doesn't like cavemen, so he does a lot of dirty, dirty tricks. Dead. One more. Yeah, fire is very ooga booga. Down and out. Suck up. This is actually faster, like... So, usually you do the cliff method when, uh... You know, you can't instant kill them. But if you can instant kill them, it's faster than trying to get their asses all the way over there. Uh, fire link, fire link, fire link, fire link. Yes, we must prove it. Y'all are correct. All right, let's make our way. Yeah, no, the, the cliff method is like, it's not guaranteed. I even mess up with it where I fall off. Like, it's very tricky. You have to put yourself in a very certain spot because if you don't hit it the right spot, it can launch you off because of the physics of the slide on an edge that FromSoft thought was a fun idea. And sometimes the mage doesn't want to cooperate, so. Can I have your resin? I'll take 61, please. Thank you. Somehow got 10 Estus, I'll take it. I have Homeward Bone. Alright, we got I think we have a good chunk of resin to work with now. Jamba, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? All right. We keep going. Oh, I, that's what I've been meaning to ask y'all. Do y'all prefer me, because I was doing some research last night with streaming. Do y'all prefer me streaming on YouTube, or would y'all prefer me streaming on Twitch? And then just putting, like, a, a VOD on YouTube. Like, on a, I guess, like, a VOD channel. Because I know, technically, I think Twitch is better for streaming, for what I understand. I have very limited knowledge in it, so... I figured y'all would know better than me. YouTube? Oh, you don't have Twitch? I gotcha. Makes sense. Makes sense. I guess I could always try. I'll dig into multi-streaming. I just know some people prefer Twitch. But, obviously, my main source of audience is obviously YouTube. It makes sense. 
No, Ryan, I don't blame you. I'm also YouTube based. Yeah, biased. Read the word too fast. You would get Twitch to watch me? I appreciate it. Like, I don't want to, like, obviously force y'all to go to a different platform, right? Or just from what I understood when I was looking into things. I wasn't close enough, and I knew it too. Oh, I rolled. Okay. I was still locked on. No, I, I judged the distance wrong on that one, which was when I did it, I was like, I am too far when I pressed it. And I was like, fuck. I had to be like a hair closer. I just was like, I need to hurry up and get to him. I wish. I'm sorry. No, I fucked it up. I was just, nope. <laughs> Not at all. Nope. At this point, I'm like, just, just, I'm just swinging. Let's just, I'm just hoping to hit the ball. No poke me, good sir. I don't like to be poked. I have PTSD for being poked by Ornstein. Either side works for me as I have both and I'm willing to help out for a good content creator how I can in either platform. Oh, I appreciate it, uh, Phantom Eve. I just remember yesterday, I forgot who who had said it, was asking if I, would, if I streamed on Twitch or not. But then they mentioned multi-streaming. I was just, I remember that uh, sentence being said, and I started to do some research last night before going to bed. Oh, beating uh, Super Mario 6, uh, no, Mario 64 without jumping. Oh, yeah, yeah. This, and Mar I haven't played Mario 64 in years. That's, that's a nostalgia trip right there. Oh, thank you, Luke. I forgot power with that. That's fine. I'll live with it. Man. Oh, I survived. I'm probably going to die. You know what the sad reality is, guys? If I had power within, I'm pretty sure that might have killed. Dual streaming is a bit too set up, but it's possible. Yeah, I remember I remember looking into it, and there's... Um, I think there's, like, a third party that you can go with that allows you to, like... Because the one thing that I would be, like, a big... Because I did it recently. I went, like, observe uh, Gino's uh, live chat and stream. But it seems like his chats are separated, right? Like, YouTube had its own chat. Like, Twitch had its own chat. And it seemed kind of a bit confusing with them being separated instead of into one. But apparently there's a third-party program that has... That allows to have a singular chat between the two. Which would be nice, right? It would suck to have two different chats. Yeah, would it would be close to power within. Yeah, maybe like 10% like left or something, right? But, it, yeah, that's a shame. I didn't have it, but... <clears throat> it was... It, oh, man, that's what I need to do. When it's about to go off, I need to hold the block button. That's what I need to do. Because I'm surprised I survived it without the... Uh... Also, I had full health, though. But, we'll see. Or maybe it's too much. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, hey, Miyazaki's back. I formally apologize for Tor's design. I knew he needed more spins. <laughs> Thank you, Miyazaki. <laughs> I believe they'll be separated on platform, but you can have a singular chat set up on screen. Yep. Yep. Alright. Uh, okay, power within. We're not just doing fire. Power within. Artorias, be a deer and do the exact same thing you did last time. Be a sweetheart. That worked. I committed. I regret committing. Wait. No. Oh, that's this. 
Okay, that's on me. I forgot to move the SS back down. But I'm getting better about blocking, and blocking seems to be a good option here. Come on, me, focus. Whatever little bit of brain cells I have left, use them. Alright, come on. Oh, that's true. I didn't think about it as well when you said separating the platforms, because no matter what, I would see both, but they wouldn't see both. Yeah, hmm. Yeah. So it's very interesting. I'm curious of how it goes. I would have to watch Gino and them, because I know Gino and I think little Aggie both multi-stream. But I know it's, there's some big streamers like Ludwig that I think I saw recently say he's not a, a fan about it. But also he has a contract with YouTube, so I don't I don't see him being wanting to multi-stream. But pop a push, yeah. Because I'm only gotta get a few more. Let's see, caveman coated their makeshift weapon with a fiery pine resin and used magic. Sir, I would call that kind uh, was it kindling? That you can just then light on fire. <laughs> That's my thought process on. I think it's friction. You're just rubbing the stick really fast until it gets on fire. I wouldn't call it magic. At least that's what I'm going with. <laughs> it's all friction. Oh yeah, power thin. I did, I did it last time, I think. I just, I need to remember, after charcoal, go back to Estes. Because that fucked me over a second ago. Oh, I tried to block it. I tried to block it. I wasn't fast enough. That was a kind of scary round for a second. But the blocking the AoE is definitely better. Why didn't I go for the large sticks? So, the reason at, earlier on yesterday, the very beginning of the run, we had the... Ho masochistic idea to say hey wouldn't it be fun if we made it harder by only using the starting club so that's what happened oh no trust me we it, it was on the table originally and then we had the bright idea to make it harder because we were all depressed by how powerful the club was so we're like let's just keep going with the club so now i am too far in to give up on that idea Three hits would stop his buff. Okay. Three just three or once, right? Or I just need to have the stamina. I just need the stamina. Because unfortunately by the time I get to him, I have to run to him. Unless I get lucky and he's um you know, like doing it right there by me. Yeah, I didn't have enough time, Ryan, on that one to get to him. So I just went for the uh, R2. 
really, if he wouldn't have done that one move, I think I would have been fine. I would have been helped up. I would have had a good chance. Yeah, it's really... It's that one move is gonna fuck me over. Especially, I know I'm within range for him to want to do it too, so it sucks. But I was also worried if I didn't heal immediately, he was gonna, um... You know, do one of his faster attacks. And then I was like, oh, maybe I can survive it, but... Yeah, we just need one good one, because we're definitely getting him a lot lower now with the pine resin. At least in a like a lot more hits. <clears throat> I think you'll add a cooking minute game to the Elden Ring. <laughs> you know, I think some people probably would not actually be opposed to that <laughs> in some regards. Like have a crafting system where you can make like a uh, different things. That would actually be an interesting class in uh like an alchemist where you use items in a uh, Elden Ring. Or any game, really. Oh, yeah, those two hits. Yeah, so I found... So that's the one thing I noticed, though. If he does his big leap, I can usually get those two hits in. If he does anything else, I can't get two hits in. So far, it seems that's been pretty consistent. I didn't want to be in front of him. Oh, he actually ran away. Don't retaliate. No, good sir. Do you oh, did I get you out of it and you're not going to do it? I'm not going to make it to you. I'm just going to have to deal with it. No. I honestly thought he wasn't going to do it again, so I slowed down. Atorius, why do you have issues with flipping? I think that time I got in front of his face, so he didn't do his normal retaliation. He's usually always behind. Yeah, Taurus is a damn flip-flop. Just keep running. Should there be a skill tree in Dark Souls 4? Oh. Oh. I don't know. I think, uh, I think it would be more cool to just have different upgrade paths. Like for weapons, just to change them up. So then you give people options, like, you have this weapon, but then you can go this route. You can go this route. And you can be, like, more and more creative. Instead of, you know, just having thousands... Well, I guess you could keep all the weapons, and each weapon could possibly go a different route. Kind of like how we have in Dark Souls 1. Where you can do different elements, but you could do different things where, like, oh, if you make this weapon into a fire weapon, it gets a special art. That'd be pretty neat. <laughs> the make sure that I had the rod and shit swamp. Damn it. That. God damn it. Fuck me. I was so stupid. That was such a good run. I fucked it up because I forgot to put the Estus back. God, I'm a fire. That was me being an idiot. All right. That would be fan of me, yeah. I would that would be really cool if they did go that route though.
<clears throat> All right, come on. I'm dead. I knew I should have did a bit sooner and I hesitated. Man, you would think with the two heavy attacks, like during that animation, it would cut him out of it, but it doesn't. Unfortunately, it does not. Come on. Come on, a Taurus. Uh, yeah, I'm going to get nipped, of course. Keep running. Oh, uh, our Taurus is about to take the cake, actually. I think it's taking me longer than Ornstein and Smoke, because prior to uh, our Taurus, Ornstein and Smoke gave me the most trouble. But I'm pretty sure uh, Artorias has just taken the cake. But with Ornstein and Smo, I had a bit more survivability. Uh, but with Artorias, it's not really happening. Plus, his RNG is way worse at this point. Oh, yeah. If I would get lucky, yeah. Yeah. That's what it is. I also fucked up. It could have been done. I fucked up twice in some cases where it probably could have been done sooner. So. I'm on. Oh, you retaliated. Now I'm dead. Oh, he doesn't always retaliate. Sometimes he'll sit there and he'll do the other thing. He doesn't always get uh, decide to do that. 245 on Autori so far? Yep, it's about to hit the three. I'm pretty sure that's longer than uh, Ornstein and Smo at this point. I think Ornstein and Smo was maybe a little bit over, just barely over two hours. I could be wrong. I don't remember from yesterday. Yesterday was a long day. I feel like at this point he's having fun with it. Me or our <laughs> Tori? <laughs> Uh. Oh no, don't provoke me. It's more like I just need to find the right rhythm and not fuck up. I just keep making simple mistakes. Oh, Taurus? Yeah, well, he's having fun with it. He's, he's having a field day. He's racking up a lot of kill streaks right now. Game bone. A hundred percent. Probably should do power with it. Oh, you, why? Why do you spaz it so much? 
when you're powered up. It's like when you're powered up, you're like, I'm just going to spin, 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 spin. <sighs> it seems like he's really consistent in the powered up, like, phase to want to do his flip. Like, I don't recall. I could know. Maybe that is true. I'm trying to recall back to when I fought him with the Skull Lantern if he got really, like, hard with it during that phase. Uh, Akios, yeah, it depends. Uh, I think what we discovered yesterday that Smo is really, well, for well, at least for me, Smo is easy in both the first phase and the second phase, whereas Ornstein is just hard in both phases for me. Unless you're doing a range uh, uh, build, then they're not really bad at all. Yeah, I need to do power within last, because I've been doing it first, and it's taking off more health. That's what's called greed. And I fucked up. <clears throat> I honestly thought that I was going to be able to get a no I, I Funny enough, if I wouldn't have walked left, I would have been fine. It's all because I walked left. If I would have walked right, I wouldn't have died. That's the funny part. Yep, he was one hit away. Yep. Uh, probably. I didn't think about it in time. Maybe if I would have blocked, I would have survived. I didn't think about it, though. My reaction was not on point. Oh, lordy. Don't let this man gamble. <laughs> Jeff, my name is Jeff. <laughs> Jeff, my name is Jeff. Yeah, I went for it thinking, like, to be honest with you, like, I thought for sure maybe that it would have maybe potentially had a good chance to kill, but it didn't. I also didn't know what he was going to do. And part of me is like, I really want to, I don't know, greed, greed, greed. No, but I shouldn't. It's, it's, I shouldn't be being greedy. That's. If he did anything else, I would have been fine. Anything else, I would have been fine. He had to do the one thing I couldn't dodge. Aren't, uh, uh, dude, Artor is just, he keeps fucking me up, man. He's just, he's ramming it really hard into me. Just full throttle, back and forth, not giving me a breather. When he jumps phase two, can you not run to him? 
Uh, I just don't have much stamina, so by the time I get there, it's hard. It's kind of like the, the issue with me not having that much, like, with only leveling strength. I don't have the stamina to um, get to him in time and, like, bonk him. But it's really just, if he wouldn't have done that, I would have been fine. I'm also, like, because of the other times he didn't do it, part of me is like, oh, he won't do it. So part of me is like, if I do hit him here, it's two extra hits potentially, or one extra hit. So then it speeds it up, and if I get lucky, he doesn't retaliate or do an attack that can just abuse me. I can then just get up, walk away, heal. But also I have power within ticking down, so I'm like, oh wait, can I get far enough away to actually heal and be fine? Uh, so it just really depends. Hey, Alex, you're back. <laughs> you know, I say I don't think about it in the moment. <laughs> Uh, why did you move? Ah, uh, damn it. Nameless King or Millennia? Ooh, yeah, that's a good call. Just keep beating my head against the wall. No, no, yeah, no, it, it's it's locked on to. So because you're supposed to roll in a circle to dodge it. Like, you're not even supposed to roll away. It's like a legit circle that you're supposed to roll to get, like, get away from it. A lot of FromSoft's, like, in Dark Souls 1, the attacks are just, like, very, like, they, they let them, like, hardcore target you. Like, all, prim I think I could be wrong in this, but I'm pretty sure all projectiles are, like, heat-seeking. They all will curve to a degree to get to you. Like the arrows, which I, I showed in my, I think my bow video, or was it the shield, or it might have been the bow video that I showed that you could see the curve in the arrow. And it's the same thing with magic, magical curve. They just, a lot of enemies have that like 180 spin too, where like there'll be one direction and then all of a sudden they're another direction. Oh, you have the, oh, you're actually riding them down. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Do that, pop this, pop that, pop that, good to go. Oh, fuck. I didn't... I didn't have my camera turned. So I was trying to just go... Hmm. hmm. That was a pretty good run. Alright, I need to change it. I need to do 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 it. I've been holding off on it. Where is it at? I'm pretty sure I had to do this for the double fight. I had to put on like seven. So I can rotate faster. I need to be able to see him. Like, I don't mind. Like, I need to run away and see him while running away. And the camera's just too slow. But it's gonna make adjusting oh, like, a little bit more. I'm gonna have to... Oh, probably. I should be used to it. It's not too... Oh, where did you come from? But I don't know if y'all noticed it, too. It seems like when I run at that diagonal, it seems like he keeps doing that one... Uh, the big lunge every time and he'll always go to the same spot so I'm curious if you can actually keep making him re like at least the starting repeat that pattern as like a setup right at least it'll be an interesting future note to like okay I can force Artorias to do this one move every time at the beginning to 
at least predict no, I can get some damage in. Oh yeah, go for it. I uh, I think the only mods I've played though were the Double Trouble mod. I haven't done anything else. Oh, I have not actually. And you retaliated? Oh, okay. That was the most cheap thing I've ever seen on Taurus. He went for the kill. He wasn't fucking around that time. He went for like, I'm insta killing you now. You're not living. Uh, I have not. I it's like it's on my radar though for sure, to try out those mods. Cause I know I think the DS1 Daughter of Ashes mod makes the game pretty harder, and I think it adds some bosses and it changes up some of the areas. And same thing with DS3. Uh, I've never done any modding with DS3, so. But yeah, I, I've heard a lot of good things about some of the mods they have. Cause like, doesn't DS3? Hey. Doesn't DS3 have that mod where, like, you can play, like, a uh, JoJo character, or, like, play as, like, JoJo or something, where you just use summons type of stuff to, like, hit people? Do I have... I do not have the Ring of Steel protection, because... Uh, because I know it would give me 40 more defense, right? But then I would have to break the other ring if I don't use the wolf. So I don't know what's more important, the wolf or the... Because, obviously, I could survive without... Because if he hits me when I don't have the wolf on, I don't think I'll... I don't always get stunned by his attacks. Yeah, th that 40 defense though might help though. You're not wrong. I just don't know what's better, having a higher poise or having a higher defense. I call bulls. Oh no, I'm in his line. Man, again, if he just wouldn't do it, I would. Uh. Let's see. I played all three of them and I could play. Yeah. Luke, I saw someone poison an apostle for eight. Oh my god. Because of a mod and he played escape. Oh my lord. That's insane. I'm still waiting for the DS1 Nightfall mod and some others that might come out in the future. Okay. There's the red testosterone. Red testosterone. Rare, red, maybe it should be as testosterone, but red tear stone ring, which is when you're below 20% HP, you do 50% damage. Yes, that's true. That is a potential good... But the issue is, let's say we, we double up, right? Because obviously I can't get hit at all at that point because 20% I'm, I'm being one-shotted. The risk of also, let's say you do power thin with the 50%, that's what... This power thing gives you 40%? And then you get 50, so that's like 90% more damage? I don't... Maybe it would give me some good first hits, but I would have to heal right after. But it is a possible option to do more damage at the very beginning and then take it away. But then I do... So, it's an option, yeah. To use the red uh, tear stone ring. Or I just don't fuck up like I've been doing. But... Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm.
Uh, I knew it too. I was like, man, I think my health's too low. Let's see. Gotta think. Gotta think. Gotta think. Yeah, for both the defense and in general, I think my HP was a bit lower for survival. Because even when I had quite a bit of HP, it's still, even when blocking, it takes a good chunk off. Two hits and back up? Yeah. Yeah. I think it's, I don't know, I, part of me thinks you almost don't have enough time. Well, I spent, well, maybe two, I should probably, that you're probably right, do two R1 hits and then run away. That's probably the smarter move. Let's do that. Two R1s instead of the R2. Just keep beating my head against the wall. Yeah, that's true if I don't have to heal up. Atari, yes, you suck. I went for the risk game biscuit. Don't do it. I tried to block it. That is a massive amount of damage. You know what? That was my idea. Uh, nope, the radius. Because of the, uh, circle button, it, because of the run animation, takes a half, like, it literally takes half a, a half a second before you start running. I think I would have to do one hit and run away. Okay, new rule. I only do one hit on him and I run away. I'm not gonna try to withstand it. It's, even though I get more damage off, I need to be, I need to actually start playing like I was playing, like, with the Skull Lantern and just be efficient and not aggressive because lately i've been I was like i'm just gonna be super aggressive and just keep hitting him and i'll get him i need to just actually play it like i was playing uh my previous run yep one and back up y'all is hit boxes man bad bad hit boxes Clubbing time. Gotcha, Ryan. Uh, I'm not dodging that. So hard. Like, I don't know why FromSoft thought it was a smart idea for your run animation. It's, oh, that's why. Because they had to map three actions to one button that it takes a half a second to run because it, the, the game doesn't know if you're going to roll or not. Oh, the poor coding. Oh, the poor coding. Because I was trying to figure out in my head, like, man, why does it take a half a second for it to know for you to run?
All right, come on. Man. Holy lordy. All right, set that up. That ready, that ready. Wonder if I could get to him with enough stamina to do three R ones. Mm. Okay. Don't retaliate. You little fucker. Oh, hitbox. His literal hitbox, like, stopped me. It literally, it literally, like, jiggled me, and I was like, oh, you, I knew I got hit by it. From sopping your jink. You jinky jink. Uh, have a say, because in reality, we need to start up before we reach max speed, like a car, for example. This has got to be wearing on your sandy. Oh, good bit, Ryan, but it's okay. Hey, listen to what he starts for <laughs> when things were going so well, Phantom Eve. <laughs> oh. oh, Jagged Bird. Thanks for joining, man. You go have a good night's sleep. That does not that's not what I want. And we go down and around. Okay, our Taurus. Okay. We are all in the DS curse. First try might always be the. Yeah, you know, you're right. The first one was really good. It was a good run, that first one, where what, the RNG just lined up perfectly, and I, I didn't utilize it. Nope, wrong button. Oh, fuck. I rolled. I was double tapping. Ugh, I fucking hate that he did that. I got scared. <clears throat> I don't have any souls to lose. Could it be? What could it be? Oh yeah, armor for came in the wear. Yeah, be like the pants, like Goku. Let's see. I think it takes what seven hits with heavy.
I wasn't far enough away from him. I was in that weird curve, and I was like, fuck, I'm not in a good spot. The embassy, when he sees the caveman going back in over a hundred times, I, man, I might be nearing 200 at this point. I don't even know how many times I've, because if we're looking at this, I had 61 of them. I'm at 39. And I was, I went two hours prior to that. I mean, it's probably 200 something deaths or more at this point. Oh, I'm going to keep going, Phantom Eve. I'm going to keep beating my head. Oh. <sighs> Really, in that last one, it was a weird position that I was in. I was like, I didn't know what he was going to do. I didn't know really where to go. I probably what I should have done instead of healing was position myself to know that, okay, in any direction I go, I'll be fine. I was kind of in a weird spot when he came at me. I probably shouldn't freak out too much about health. I probably should just be risking it to a degree. Is it honestly in his second phase, I, I pretty much can get one shotted. No. I wasn't running, so I couldn't dodge it. If I'm not running when he's doing it, I can't get away fast enough. I really hate that he runs up and could do it. <clears throat> really wait, uh... Hmm. Also, I think in that other one, I should have went for two hits. I was trying to be a bit more cautious. But it wouldn't have changed anything. Oh, do it. How oh, you did it. Sometimes all you need is someone to believe and send you those good vibes. You're 100% right, Phantom Eve. You're 100% right. Yo, I went to sleep and just woke up and you're still... Yeah, yeah, I'm still at Hotorius. Yeah. It's a very tough fight. It is not... It's not being fair. It's, 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 it's a rough one. He's fan, you're still dreaming. Oh, come on. Yeah, yeah, to a degree, yeah. Of course he retaliated. I didn't- there's no way for me to get away. Damage is very good, Muhammad. It's very good. I thought for a second I had him. He was doing pretty good repeating patterns, but the second he retaliated, I was getting one-shotted.
Yeah, it's, you're right, Ryan. It's just a matter of not getting hit. It's just unfortunate that he has that random chance of just retaliating. You just don't know if he's going to do it or not. I think that's what makes him, like, a hard fight. It, well, again, he was designed for you to roll. He was 100%, like, because when you get knocked down or anything, you can roll immediately when you get back up, or, like, as you're getting back up. So he was designed for it. He's, like, trying to go against his... It's like Sekiro, right? You're going against the whole design of pairing, and it's, it's going to make it a lot harder. So, that's pure RNG just fucking in the ass. If he wouldn't have done that... God, man. That is true, Phantom E, that is true. Yeah, I went for the two hit because sometimes he'll like I he will sometimes roll away and I was like I would put him in one shot range and I was like I'll go for it. No, he does not apparently. I don't know what the fuck just happened there with the lock-on system, how I completely whiffed. barely poked my feet. In the sunshine. Fucking me over with your bullshit AI. Your RNG is bullshit. Oh, 
Hello, retaliation. That's called greed. I shouldn't have greeted. I, I for some reason I thought I was closer. You're not wrong, Phantom Eve. You're not wrong. Oh, <laughs> uh, you're not wrong. Dude, I don't know what he was aiming at for. I wasn't complaining, though. I just wish I didn't fuck it up so bad. I thought I was closer, and I thought the lunge would get him. I didn't realize he was that far. But either way, as we could tell, his, his decision... Well, I don't know. Maybe his decision would have changed if it would have hit him. But his decision was to obviously do his spin flip. What's my favorite anime? That's a... Ooh. Ooh, that's a hard question. Uh, just some guy who likes shooters. That's a very hard question. I have to really think about it because I like, I have one in my head, but I have to really think. Probably. It's probably like my favorite. Favorite's probably Code Geass. If I have to say. Just because when I watched it when I was in high school. And it was like, I watched it in high school and it also resonated with me to some degree. And plus, I, the plot was really good. And it was probably, it was the first anime, or probably any like movie film or like any type of like entertainment or thing that was able to actually like legitimately bring tears to my eyes. So that's probably why I, I hold it in some high regard. Yeah, I think also it's my girlfriend's favorite anime too. Funny enough. Man, why does it work sometimes and sometimes it doesn't? It's like he- I honestly think he curves sometimes. Like, if you- like, if you're not waiting for the proper second, he, like, slightly curves. Oh, Parasite's a really good one, too. Parasite's a really good one. Yeah, I'm very confused, but because y'all see it too sometimes. Like, I, I feel like I am hitting it hard. I might be wrong. Maybe I'm seeing it wrong. I feel like I'm hitting it hard enough right. I bet a Guitar Hero controller would make it easy. I bet you're right. The power of the whammy bar would just help me out. Like, not joking aside, I have considered, like, doing an entire run with the uh, Guitar Controller. Or doing a challenge run with the Guitar Controller of a challenge run, right? So I had to play it with the guitar controller and do a challenge run on top of it. I have had that thought. Because I thought it was funny. Now, I probably wouldn't do like a super, super hard one, but it just depends. Actually, probably wouldn't do a super, super hard one. Probably be more re reliable to do something of like... It's a bit more feasible. Oh no, nine minutes now. Uh, in a way, like I said, I am very hard-headed, Ryan. When I mean like I'm hard-headed, like I will keep beating my head for a very, 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 very long time. It's not healthy. That's just who I am.
You didn't have to throw that. That's rude. Yeah, I can't double block it. I'm getting really, really confused by his freaking lunge attack. It doesn't make sense. I'm pretty sure he has to. He has some slight heat seeking. Like I think he does slightly turn. I could be wrong. I really do need to go into dev mode and test things out and just know for sure. Good animates to watch would be magic and muscles, one piece. Hunter, Hunter, Full Metal Alchemist, etc. Yeah, those are good ones. One Piece, God, that would take forever. It's so long. For the anime, I would almost recommend the manga over the anime just because it's faster to read the manga. In the anime, I think the anime has quite a bit of filler, too, so. But if you're dedicated enough to get into it. I, yeah, to a degree, I think about it, but it's like I have some, like... Yeah, I've been debating it too, Mohammed. What is the site to watch him? Oh, uh, that I'm not too sure. I haven't watched... It's been a long time, actually, since I've watched anime. I think it's been... I want to say it's been... Well, no, that's a lie. I'm thinking from when I sat down to watch anime, like, for myself, was probably two or three years ago and then but my girlfriend was watching demon slayer so she wanted me to watch it with her so that was probably about a year and a half ago or a year but unfortunately with the time i have i don't have too much free time to sit down and watch anime anymore i'll read manga because it's faster though but it's the unfortunateness of having a lot of things to do to sit down to watch a 20 minute thing sometimes especially when you have to read it it's harder but if i would if i learned japanese completely then i wouldn't have this issue No way. No way to dodge it. Man, I really wish that when I got him down the one hit left, I wouldn't have fucked it up. Could have been done with this shit. How do you have for 20 episodes if you have several for Artorias? Uh, one of them has the ability where I make a video out of it and I make something creative, whereas the other one, I'm just sitting in a and like ingesting the entertainment it's just you know the, it's the choice of free time it's not that i don't have the free time you're not wrong in that statement it's the choice of what, what i want to do with that free time right so like the, the time i have will be making videos finishing the challenges run to make the videos uh spending whatever free time i have with my girlfriend um going climbing trying to go out and do outdoor activities when you like start looking at it from that whole especially like, like i said i do the challenge runs and i have to edit the videos it, you, your time gets very finite. And then my I get so exhausted by the end of the day to sit down to want to read something on a screen. Because again, you have to read the text. I just don't want to. Like, I'll be honest, when I read manga sometimes, it's more of a skim. It's not a legitimate read. But at the same time, yes, no matter what, I have the time to actually legitimately watch it. I just choose not to. Because I feel like the time I, I should be investing should be going to other things. Or watch an anime about Artorias. Oh, that would be good. That would... That's a, that's a challenge run. You have to watch anime, understand what's going on the entire time while doing the run. fucking flip like i can't do nothing about it that's what sucks like he literally will just flip like he, it, i have to hit him 
because it's my free opportunity. I run away, but his response is immediately flip. And it's, it's, you can dodge it. It's just hard. Like, and it's, I'm very inconsistent at it. Stupid fucking flip. <laughs> Do Artorias while doing a driving test. Try to spell the words. <laughs> okay, come on. Triple in Oh, dear God. No, I don't know about that one. I, after doing the double... I, if I did triple, I'm using any weapon. I just have PTSD from, uh, just using the fist weapons. Okay, I actually thought he was doing his, uh, thing. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Why? Why does he curve? I, I can't outrun his curve. I definitely did a hard right. Why? Why? Why couldn't you have done the spin thing? Why couldn't you have done the spin? The spin. You know, you didn't have to do the lunge. You could have done the spin. It's just a little spin. Ritter? Oh, don't touch me. Oh, don't. Let's see. Did you give yourself a breather at one point after all these challenges Challenges, and just do the one punch mod? <laughs> just, just that satisfaction of just instant killing all of them. Rider? Oh, Artorius, you bastard. You don't fight fair with your stupid RNG. I would say, Punk Geeks, if I get him low, then we can start saying it might be the one. Because <laughs> I just never know with him. It's like gambling. I'm at the slot machine, I'm expecting to win the lottery at this point. I'm just sitting there, sitting on my chair, putting in a quarter, pulling the crank, and just hoping all the sevens line up in a row. The name would be Ritter or Taurus.
I gotta bonk him to death. That is true. That is a good point, Phantom Eve. You can only lose 100% of your money while gambling, but you can earn 9,999% do the math. That's true. That's true. Man, he's been doing that combo. Beating my head against the wall. A very, very, very thick wall. Starts breathing loud again. That is a good call out on that. Yeah, that may. <laughs> that would be on his dying words when he, after he dies, he's like, I am your father. Hey, there's that retaliation, RNG. Don't retaliate. I thought I had it too, guys. Thought I fucking had it. I was like, man, those were some clean dodges. And then when I saw it happen, when he got there and I hit him, I was like, he's gonna retaliate. And sure enough, I didn't have enough health to survive it. Yep, one shot again. It's that's like the unfortunate. I get into that one shot and I get retaliated. And I don't even get the opportunity to like have the chance. That retaliating RNG is just it's what makes him so that's what made him so brutal during the Skull Lantern run is that I could only hit him once and I had to I had to roll away because he's gonna like you couldn't gamble him not retaliating. Like, it's, it's such a high RNG base that it's like, you just gotta hope, oh, maybe he won't do it this time. Or the only thing I can do is when I start getting him that low is just say, fuck it, I have to make sure 
he does his big leap and force the leap every time and not even attempt. I was really hoping he was going to do his spin, but well, he can retaliate no matter what, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Yeah, when you can roll, yeah. Oh yeah, it changes a lot. Ah, uh, power within! Sorry, I didn't mean to yell. I'm just really looking at that like little bit of HP right now, and it's it's hurt. It hurts. I should have just went for the R1. I was scared. I was like, I should play it safe and not just try to swing, because so I figured I might get hit. Yeah, it, it's it, it's just teasing at this point, really. It's just a hard, hard, okay, okay. Why are we adding salt to the wound? That's not necessary. You shit little shits. In Mohammed, it is indeed painful in every possible way. You yell at the same volume you talk. Okay, that's good though. I don't want to like like you know peak the volume and it be like you know annoying. Almost there. Almost there. Really? That's, that's the crazy part. I think if the fire uh, wouldn't have ran out, I the charcoal, I actually maybe would have killed them on that uh, other hit. Because the charcoal was out. It's possible that a little bit left, it would have uh, done enough damage. Yeah, that lost rate, yeah. Yeah. That's heartbreaking. But that's not, uh, that's happened to me in multiple other runs too, where I've gotten a boss to be like that one smack away, and I just keeps going wrong. Can you attack him right after the second phase explosion? So I've tried it. He, he's been pretty good about retaliating. So that's why I stopped. I stopped doing it because it just, it, nothing was good coming from it. I wasn't running yet. My animation of running was just starting by the time I saw him. I was like, yep, I'm fucked. Because <clears throat> I think you can actually, from what I noticed that other time where I got really close, that if I run in a, a legitimate circle, so instead of just that pure hard right, like I'm trying to get behind his behind, it's it seems like it's doable, but the run animation didn't start in time, so I didn't have the momentum. If I would have had that stupid little startup... Gotta get the little engine going. The little engine that could. Yeah, it's true. He, you don't know. He sometimes doesn't do all three. Sometimes he'll do one, too. He's, it's between one, two, or three. You don't know. Gonna get him. Gonna beat him. And then I get to go to bed. 
and then my girlfriend gets to judge me in the morning. Tommy, hey, just joined now. Who's been the biggest problem so far? Artorius. <laughs> and that's who we're fighting right now. <laughs> I didn't realize all chat. Artorius, Artorius, Artorius. <laughs> <laughs> yeah oh really can it do up to five? Oh damn maybe he could was continuing interesting i think the most i've had him do to me is three okay come on Of course you're going to retaliate, and I only have one HP. Don't flip. That's fine. Oh no, oh no, that's bad. Yep, yep, power within. I honestly thought I dodged it. What is with your hitbox, man? How? Like, I thought I did a perfect curve, but his curve was better. Oh. Yeah, yeah, Tom. It, it, it hasn't been going well. <laughs> I'm not... I will be... I'm probably nearing... I'm definitely in the 200 deaths by now. I, I find it really hard to believe that I haven't. It's not going to be fun to uh, edit. Like, when I go to edit, I have to find all of them. That's not going to be fun. I have to cut each individual one so I know exactly the number. Y'all, y'all just want to poke me. It's a little too much, and I don't like it. Oh no, no, yeah, Tom, it's really good. I've been one H, I've been one hit away from him like three or four times now. It's just I've been getting because every time I get him to like that one little bit of HP left. Well, unfortunately, the last time was power. Th I, power thin got me because I didn't heal soon enough. And then some of the other times was that Artorius just retaliated at the right time. In which his retaliation is that pure RNG. So you just get fucked. Oh yeah, I, I have that like 0001% health. Yep. Do that. Do that. Do this. Do that. Do that. Do that. Try not using power within. Uh, I probably could, but I don't know. It's probably a good option to attempt, I guess, not to have the tick. But then it's going to take more hits, right? Because power within is giving me that 40%. I was going to die anyways. When I saw him charging as I was getting up, I couldn't do nothing. Yeah, if let's say uh, let, let him cook, I did without power within. That's a 40% reduction. So that's probably... That's, that's going to be a lot more hits I'm going to have to do. And as we know, with the RNG, it's almost better for me to try to DPS them as fast as I can. Which, again, maybe it would be a wise option for me to go get the red tear stone ring and gamble it on the first hit just to do, like, massive amount of damage and then heal up. Yeah, not yeah. well, strength only, yeah. If I could do health, it would make the, the ball game would be so much easier if you could just tank it. Yep. Oh, computer, why? My computer just said, screw me. I don't know why, the game just went into Windows mode. Oh, wow, why is that blue tint? What the fuck, computer? Whoa, I thought the computer's kicking me off. Okay, what's going on? Okay, the controller, what? So I don't know what just happened, but it's not recognizing my controller. 
That's not good. So the light's on, so the game's not reg. Okay, I might have to turn the game off and turn it back on. I don't know what just happened. That's weird. It just randomly bugged out. Dark Souls doesn't want me to play anymore. How rude. Driver issue, maybe? It's possible, yeah. Man, it's not even one... Okay, fuck it. I'll manually close it. I'll pop it back up. Let's see if it works now. I swear, if it's Steam... It could be Steam. Sometimes Steam will screw me over. I think it's Steam. My controller's not even... Oh, man. It's definitely Steam. Because it's not... Nothing's responding to it. This happens. This has happened to me before. Where all of a sudden... I have to, like, literally restart my computer to make it work. Oh. It's literally gone so far that the, the computer's like, I'm going to kill you off, essentially. Because the, the, the keyboard controller, it will not recognize the controller. Because I turned it off and turned it back on. I'll try one more thing. If that's the case, then we might have to continue it from tomorrow. And I just got to call it. So I'm going to close this. I'll try closing Steam from Task Manager. Um, or yet yeah, Steam. And see if, if I force reboot that. It could just be the computer, though. Yeah, Taurus, yeah. Taurus is like so much like, you know what? I'm tired of seeing you. I'm shutting the game down. We're like, we're ending this once and for all. Yes, Steam, you can take your sweet old time loading back up. Thank you. Open that, open that. Library. Play, play. All right, let's see if it works on the computer now. Or right, work with the controller. Nope, it's my PC. Actually, for shits and giggles, I'm going to try one time with the uh, mouse and keyboard. Because I'm kind of curious. This is what, it's WSD, it's, uh, I don't need space, oh, uh, it's shift right with keyboard, I want to do continue, please. It's shift right for keyboard, for sprinting. Or is it space bar? Is it space bar? It is space bar. That's gonna be weird. <clears throat> Alright, I'll give it a shot. Actually, I don't know how to use power within or any of that. It's E, isn't it? Is it E? Wait, how does it work? How do you switch? How do keyboard... Is it... Ma oh, scroll wheel? Oh. Now the question is, how do I unequip the whip? This is gonna be interesting. You can move faster though when you have the mouse. I'm oh, sorry, I shouldn't go that fast. E to recover there. Okay. I'm only going to try this once and I'm going to call it. Because <laughs> obviously I should be playing with the controller, but my computer just said, screw you, you got to restart me. Well, that's a roll. I'm just going to let it go. I don't want to have to go back. <laughs> Plus, I probably should stop. <laughs> but. There we go. Is it E? Okay, what button is it? F? Okay, so F is to grab. What buttons do you usually ask this? C, V, X, Q, 
No, Q looks like lock on. R? So R. Okay. It would be more comfortable with this. I understand. Okay, this is weird having it on the space bar now. This is very funky. Uh, I'm assuming left click, left click for it. So that's normal. So right click is your... Okay. So that would be R. Go back down. That's heavy. And then F to match. And E to go in. I'm going to die really, really fast. Because this already feels really, really weird. Oh, why did it block? What's the heavier attack? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. This is going bad. The camera! This is so weird. Wait, no. I meant to press R, not EC. Yep, that was fun. I just, uh, I was just curious. That is really weird. That is really, really weird. Mouse and keyboard. But that was fun. That was fun to mess around. Yeah, we'll have to pick it up tomorrow. Just because I would have kept going, but my computer decided to give me the middle finger, apparently. Or Dark Souls 1 decided to say, screw your computer, one the two. I only, this only ever happens with Dark Souls. I've never had it happen. This was, this has happened before. I don't. It doesn't happen with any other game. But let's do again tomorrow for 5.30 p.m. East Central Time. To continue this hell loop of dying to a Taurus. It was great to come out from the start to the end of the stream. Yeah, yeah, uh, just a guy who likes shooters. Glad that you were able to make it the whole thing. Yeah, so same time tomorrow for the start. Thank you, uh, Let Him Cook. I really appreciate it. Alex, yeah, man, if you can make it, that'd be great. If you can't, no worries. No biggie. Yeah, I'm sorry, Tom. I would have kept going, but it's just uh, unfortunately the computer wanted to... Make is like I guess the computer's like you're going to bed apparently. Is so it when it flickered? I was like, what is that? Yeah, I too. I hope so too, Muhammad. That I don't have to actually legitimately go back and retry this again because the recording's going to be jank. But we'll we'll see. But we'll end it there for guys. I really appreciate all of you coming out. Hope to see y'all again tomorrow. And until next time, y'all take care.